back to some more Five Nights at Freddy's! Today, we are going to be collecting all the characters! Oh my gosh! That's probably not even half of them. Today we are playing FNAF World! Actually, one of my favorite games in the series where you get to collect all the characters just like Pokemon! And I am one of the few FNAF fans that actually likes this game! I'm so excited. So, I'm definitely going to be a little rusty at this game because, just like all the other games, I have not played this one for years. A very, very long time. But, let's pop open the game. I think that there's a one-time-only cutscene in the beginning, so... Let's watch it. Yes, it's a teaser for Sister Location. Everything that happens... Everything that happens out there has an effect here, do you understand? Oh wait, it's not Sister Location. This is a safe place. This is a sanctuary. But something has gone wrong and now it can be seen here. Something went very wrong. That's why I'm here. I'm holding the wrong plushie. But I won't let the same happen to you. I will put you back together. way too loud. It caused me to go into party mode. I am so excited to play this game! <laughs> it's been so long! You know, there is something I definitely need to mention. Um, in this little series of mine of playing all the FNAF games, there is one game that I am not going to be playing, and that is the first version of FNAF World. Why? Because I don't know where the heck to get it. And also, it's not technically a FNAF game. Not really. Apparently, it's a... Let me stop myself. What if I could find it? If I could find it, we should play it. I'll be right back. Oh my gosh! The FNAF Archive! Please don't give me a virus. Uh, yes? Is this gonna work? Okay, for those of you who want to watch me play the actual FNAF world, Skip to this time in the video and you will find it. For those of you who want to stick with me and play the crappy version first, keep watching. Now for those of you who have no idea what this is about, back when Scott was teasing FNAF World, all of a sudden he got hacked uh, by, what was it, someone named Lulz Hacks. And uh, this game got released. Oh no! FNAF World was released early! But it was actually just a troll, because Scott loves to troll us. He really does. But I remember being so excited and enjoying it wholeheartedly anyways. So I would love to revisit it, even if it's just for a really short while. Just because of nostalgia. And also, there's weirdly, like, characters in this game that, like, don't reappear? If I remember correctly, some interesting characters, so I'd love to see them again. What the heck? Ah! Did I get a virus? Please tell me that it's okay. Please tell me that everything's gonna be okay. Oh my gosh! Start! Select your class. Freddy, new. Bonnie, new. Chica, new. Okay, we could play on hard mode? Let's play on medium mode. Wow! <laughs> so it's just like how I remember. Can I- okay, how do I do anything? Actually, I don't think I can do anything right now. I don't know what that's doing. Mad Endo, dancing. 
rockin'. So that was that. Oh, that does that heal me, I guess? Yeah, that definitely heals me. I don't have enough to buy anything. But I got a chest! Found fainted noise. Is that what that said? Found chill notes. I guess those are... Something? Okay. I found more chill notes. I don't know what that is. Faint notes. Is that an attack? Tangle! Oh, it is. Okay. Go ahead and chill out, Tangle. Yeah, so Tangle never came came back. She's not part of the main game. I don't know where my health is. Oh! I found it. Oh boy! I wonder if they have specific weaknesses or anything. I think I just went into a difficult area before I was ready is all. Cheesehead! This character also did not come back. I think I need to level up around here before I do anything crazy. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna die. Mad end of strong. Okay, we're back to full health again. Yeah, I'm only level two. I wonder if I should be level two when I enter area two. It's probably good enough now. Should I enter area three? Sure, let's do it. At least there's a thing to heal me nearby. Should I really be walking this far? I don't know. I'm gonna hit a few enemies right through here first. Brow boy, oh my gosh. Let's chill him out first. And then rockin'. Oh, it's barely killing him. Oh my gosh, he's really strong. Faint. Chill out, please. I'm about to die. Faint is definitely my strongest attack, but my health is really, really bad. This is actually really hard. How does he keep unfreezing, bro? Stay frozen for a little while, thank you. Okay, I think we might be okay. Yay, we leveled up! Oh, we got full health now. Let's go back to the first map and buy some stuff. My health just halved from half bake. Oh my gosh. That was fascinating, but also this game is a little tricky. Let's go buy some stuff. Prototype. Did this guy ever make it? I can't remember. I think there is a prototype. Isn't there? Glamrock Freddy? We have a lot of gold now, though. Okay, we can buy whatever this is. I don't know what that is. But we can also buy this! Heart! We could really use a heart right now. I'll take that, thank you! Oh, that's an extra life, I bet. Okay, that's good. We're level four. Oh, this is some chill music. Should I really be wandering around here? I feel like I'm gonna die. I am asking for it right now. Oh, what is that? I don't know, but we're buying it. Anchovy! Oh, we're all out of attacks. Let's see how bad he actually is. That wasn't too bad, I don't think. Wait, yeah, it was. Bro. This is bad. 
I'm gonna have to just keep wasting all my chill on him. I'm so glad I'm not playing as Chica right now. Very thankful for that. Where's an inn? Ah! I need an inn right about now. Really bad. I'm about to die. This game requires grinding, and I did not do that. I just kind of walked. Please level up. Okay, where did I start? Oh, I'm still level four? Okay, that's not so bad. I am totally out of all my attacks though. That's good. I actually thought I was starting over from the very beginning every time. Much, much enjoyed. Much appreciated. That sucks. We're so low on health. Please make it back. Oh, come on. Oh! I think we'll survive this one. We're just gonna have to waste all of our fates! And get back to the inn. Get to the inn. Oh my gosh. We wasted all of our good stuff! Oh my gosh. This game is so hard. I'm gonna finish leveling up on this side of the map. Oh, I think we're about to die. So one of the sucky parts is, I think you lose all of your experience if you were about to level up. We definitely did. Oh well. Oh, we lost like half of our gold too. It's a shame. Ah, and we leveled up. Okay, level eight, I finally feel confident enough to leave this area. Maybe. I did end up using a lot of items in order to grind. It's not ideal, but it is, it is what it is. Also, I think the heart, the cool thing about the heart is that it allows you to heal as you're walking. It's slow, but as you can see, my health is going up, which is really a blessing. Definitely a blessing. Is this the new- no? When did this hope open up? I have no idea when this opened, but cool! What did we get? I guess we got chill- wait. We got rockin', I think. I think I was all out of that. Cool! Yeah, this is, um, a little ways behind. I'm not sure how that opened, but I'm glad it did. I wonder if something else opened up behind us. And how much does this cost? 800? Yeah, this game does not hold a cupcake candle to FNAF World. That's for sure. Because it is very, very grindy. Which is fun, but only fun to an extent. You know, after a while it gets boring. I've already been playing this game for 30 minutes, believe it or not. It's very grindy. But it is kind of fun in its own little special way. I wonder if I'm only going to be able to beat this part today. <laughs> I knew that FNAF World would be multi-day filming for me, so don't be surprised if I change clothes multiple times in this video. That's just going to be how it is. Is there anything else that opened up? Oh, I should be looking for secret pathways within all of them. Cool. Okay, so this is the first area, so let's find a secret pathway for the second area, too. I don't 
think there's a secret passageway on the second map. It's really... If there is, I cannot find it. It looks like there's something directly below us. But I can't get into it. Yeah, there's something down there. What is that? A tombstone? Yeah, I can't get in there for some reason. Oh well, moving on to the third one. We already found the secret on the third one, right up here. Maybe there isn't one for everything. And we're not far away from getting whatever that blue, gr red, blue, green, red thing is. <sighs> I'm losing my mind a little bit. <laughs> Yay, we got some more rockin' notes. Yeah, that tree did, looked very much out of place. I found another one! Oh. Should I? I have enough for the explosion now, but I kind of want the green sword. This could be really dangerous. I just passed a red line. Oh yeah, it's gonna be dangerous. Okay, let's start using some of these. Quad endo? I love it, man. I love that. I want this character to come back. Okay, I have a green sword now, heck yeah. And there's a place to heal, oh yeah. We are finally done in the mountains. Now we're in dead trees, which is a very dangerous place. I would rather not hang out here. <laughs> And we leveled up! Level 13! Oh, hello, I didn't even mean to do that. Okay, we can buy a clover. Some luck. Yeah, I'm gonna buy that. We still need to save up for the explosion. This is going well. Oh? Oh, I thought so. We can get a second heart? Heck yeah. I, uh, I had a feeling we weren't done in the mountain area. I'm glad I went back. We're getting like a ton of items now. Now I just need to save up to get that explosion thing because... That was weird. Oh, the green thing is like a poison that can happen sometimes. Sweet. Another one in the tree zone. Holy crap. Faint notes. Nice. Um, okay. Uh, I meant mountain zone. I'm not in the dead tree zone, but yeah. Dang, there are so many freaking secret items in this game. But I think I'm done looking around over here, so let's go back to the dead tree zone. You know what, this game actually has a really nice sense of progression. I'm glad I went back to it because it's been really fun already. Um, I don't know how much more there is of this game, but it's been a blast. I'm gonna be checking every freaking tree, I swear. Quad endo. This guy's kinda tough, but I've been leveling up a lot, so that really helps. And the poison, the poison is so sick. And we got the thing! Whatever it is, we got it! We'll definitely need it for when we face bosses. I say plural, but I think there's only one boss. Honestly, I don't know. It feels like as soon as you enter a new dotted area zone, all of the things that you're facing are bosses. Oh! It got hit by it! I don't even know how much damage it did, but I'm sure it did good. Cool! Party hat A. He's got so much health. What the heck? No, I'm gonna die. Oh my gosh, how is my health so low right now? I'm gonna have to use all my special stuff on him.
I was excited to see a new character, but then I immediately got unexcited when I met him and saw that he had 333 health. How much damage does he do though? 60 damage! I didn't I didn't even go into a new area. I swear this guy's just here to destroy. Oh my gosh. 60 damage. Bro. 61 damage. This guy's just gonna eat up all of my items. All of them. I can't even get hit by him again or else I'm gonna die, so I'm gonna use all of my chills. Oh my gosh, this guy sucks. <sighs> what a jerk! What was he, like, um... I don't know, a random mini boss? <sighs> My gosh. Guess that's what I get for exploring. Lose all my items. <laughs> Oh, and now we need to save up 750 for a better shield and 900 for a really good sword. I don't have anywhere near the amount of gold for those items right now. Wow. On to the next area. Pillar zone, it looks like. And uh, we got stopped right at the exit, so one moment, please. Alright guys, I have decided that I am not entering this next area until I can afford that better shield. I'm close to it anyways, I'm really not far away. And these mud pies, they do some insane damage. Sometimes they do like 12. It's pretty scary. But yeah, I'm, I'm grinding, but I'm also trying to afford the shield. And then we'll move on. <gasps> we got it! 750 gold! Awesome! Alright, we're gonna get a better shield and we're gonna move on for a little while. The sword, the super expensive sword is just gonna have to wait. It'd be great, but it's just gonna have to wait. Yay! We got a better shield now. Alright, we're crossing the line into the pillar zone. I'm scared. I haven't seen an inn for quite a while, so... But we're low on gold, so if we die, it's not a big deal. You just don't want to die with gold. Oh! Zangle! 11 damage. That's not too bad. I really like Zangle's design. It's very fascinating. It's like a dragon mangle. Breathing fire. Um, it's definitely a heavy hitter. Oh, we're gonna level up soon, so that's good. Oh, hello! I like that. And rockin' notes, I love that. Can never have enough of those items. I'm scared to get too deep in here because I don't know when Party Hat B is gonna appear. Hopefully we can level up a little bit before that happens. Ooh, 121 gold. Sick. Oh, there's another line to cross. I'm not ready for that. Big Jack. Okay, this guy shouldn't... Actually, it might be a little bit uh, dangerous. Kind of wish we were closer to the inn right about now. I think we'll be okay. As long as we don't run into anything super dangerous on our way back. <sighs> Alright, I'm gonna have to do it. I'm gonna have to use a few of these. 
because I don't want to be running around with this much gold and then lose it all. Thanks, Big Jack. I had to waste items on you. Hope you enjoyed that. And I just went the wrong way. I need to heal. Oh, shoot. At the very least, we can heal a lot by walking. I do really appreciate that. Okay, Mud Pie. Probably one of the better enemies to run into right now. I think we're gonna be fine. Yeah, we're gonna be fine. We're almost there, and I have a lot more health, so we're gonna be A-OK! -okay. It's just the first time you enter into these areas, it's always a little bit sketchy. Health. Ah! Okay, I'm really low on health, and I don't like that very much. Hopefully Zangle's not going to be a problem. Eight health? Oh, I leveled up! Ah, oh, it's a miracle! We're good! And what do we get? More rocket notes, very nice. I found one! Ooh, rocket notes and more gold! We need to go spend our gold right now, because we have enough for that sword. Last thing I want to do is lose it. Let's do this! Oh! That kind of looks like all the items that can even fit. So, are we getting close to the end? Maybe. I don't know if I'm ready. This game has been so much fun, I just want to keep playing it. I know that sounds weird, but this game is actually really fun. That's okay, we have the full Five Nights at Freddy's world coming soon. Actually, I don't think anybody calls it that. I'm pretty sure they just call it the next world. That I can sink my teeth into for a long time. Alright, let's go into the next area. The fire area! Mini P! Oh my gosh, I forgot about these! It's so cute! <laughs> oh, I'm glad it's not murdering me. This is hilarious. Okay, if we walk up to a boss, Red Bear. I think Red Bear actually did make it to FNAF World. I'm pretty sure he did. Okay, our health isn't the worst. I would like to heal, though. I would really like to heal. I'm afraid we're gonna come up on a boss, so... I'm gonna head back the other way and heal. I'm gonna check all these fire things now to see if one of them will break down for us. And also, there's Purple Geist right there. Yeah, Purple Geist was a thing before Princess Quest. Quite a long time before, really. And also, here's security! I love this character! I drew him! He's so cute! Look at how cute he is! Also, he's really strong, so... There's that. Blocked. Good. 20 damage. Yikes. Okay, at least I'm blocking most of his attacks. Oh! Whew. So thankful for the poison right now. Chests! Faint notes? Rocket notes! Yay! I love it. Oh no. Security. Oh boy. This guy is. Yikes! Oh my gosh, chill, please. Well, maybe I'll kill him in the next hit. Okay. Yikes, man, my health is bad. Let's leave. All right, guys, I am using Mini P to level up. I'm right next to Purple Geist, so then we're gonna try. Level 28 versus Purple Geist, we're gonna see if we can do it. Unless this takes well, it doesn't even matter how much damage this I get from this, actually, because I will be leveling up 
So we'll be fine. Then we'll have full health when we go against Purple Guys. So it'll be great. Oh, he went down. Easy. Alright. I'm carrying so much gold, but there's literally no more shops. So... It's not gonna matter if I die. Let's try and beat him in one try. That might have ruined my plans. Depending on how much damage he does. If he does a lot of damage, which he usually does. <sighs> yeah, so I'm not going against Purple Geist with 60 health. It's just not gonna happen. My plan was foiled, man! I was a few steps away. I have to heal now. We'll probably be level 30 by the time I get that back. Don't run into anybody, please. Oh! It's almost like it's scripted, man. Okay, this is not bad. We can do it with 100 health, I think. This is it. Level 30 versus Purple Geist. How much damage does he do? That's what I'm wondering. Let's rock his world! 30. 30. Okay, faint. Oh, it blocked. Good, good, good. Oh, I'm so glad it's blocking. I'm so glad we have faints, because if we didn't, we would be screwed. I think we're, get we're gonna make it! Yeah! We beat it! FNAF World Halloween Edition! That was so much fun! I guess I was way more scared of him than I should have been, because that wasn't too bad. With all those power-ups and special attacks and all that, it wasn't too bad. That was super fun! Oh my gosh! I'm so glad we revisited that, you guys. That actually took like an hour and a half. I'm so glad I didn't pick Chica. It probably would have been like three hours. Welcome back! Now it's time to play the real FNAF World, the main star of the show. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to play this game. I had so much fun playing it the first time around. I'm probably, I probably even played it two or three times in total. But let's do it, let's do it! Now, we are gonna have to remember, we need to work with Fredbear, because that's the only way to get the good ending? I really can't remember this game very well, you guys. I don't remember if there's a good ending or what, but I'm pretty sure Fredbear is highly important and we need to do those mini games. All right, we're gonna go with slot one, obviously. New game, erase data, yes, sure. <laughs> um, find new characters as you play, start with two fixed teams. We want to find our characters. Hard mode it is. What am I getting myself into? Okay, yeah. Um, oh my gosh, I forgot that we have two teams the whole game. Because we get to switch out. Interesting. Let's do it. I know you may feel like going out and taking a stroll, but something seems very wrong today. Space. Click. All is not well in Animatronica. Animatronic Village? Village Tronica? We're working on it. The point is that something is horribly wrong. There have been a lot of bizarre creatures roaming around lately, even some that look like us. We aren't prepared to deal with situations like this. Something bad must have happened on the flip side. Go see what you can find. Be careful though, our woodcutting auto chipper has gone haywire. It has been jump scaring me all day! As if you're afraid of jump scares. Come on, you're the king of jump scares, dude. But you don't really believe that, do you? There is a task for you to complete. You have to leave breadcrumbs for him to help him find his way. Okay, I forgot the story, so I guess we're gonna figure it out. Wow, oh my gosh. The graphics on this game. They are just goofy as heck. 
a little bit. Mendo? And Dee Dee. It's so silly. This game is so silly. Chips obviously bites. We got none of that. Save. Um, what's this? Jump? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Saved locations. I remember now. I love how he actually moved a little bit, even though I haven't moved yet. Alright, is it... yeah? <sighs> we got a chest! Ten! Um, coins? Just ten. Just ten. Hello! Welcome to Little Bit's Bite Store! You can buy a gnat, a neon bee, a neon wasp. Those are very nice later, I think. Although I don't particularly remember using those ones. These bites shoot stingers at enemies. Oh, yeah, 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 that'll be very nice. Toy Freddy, still Freddy, but shiny. Welcome to Dee Dee's Fishing Hole. Drop your fishing plunger as deep as you can for valuable prizes. Get the pearl to win 100 fast bar tokens. It costs 10. Should we bet all the money that we have? Yes. Okay. We only have 50... 55 seconds. I don't know how fast the plunger is going to go, or how slow the plunger is going to go. I have never been good at this game. Oh, we might have an opportunity coming up. No, maybe not. Oh, no. Holy crap, this game is hard, man. was so clear there for a second. Oh, it's gonna be clear again. No way! On my first try, I actually did it! <sighs> oh my gosh. That's amazing! We now have a hundred tokens. Uh, can we buy a stinger already? Yes! We can! Oh my gosh, okay. Wait a second. Let's not even buy the Neon Bee. Let's go bet some more money. <laughs> Before we- oh, she's gone! Okay, so you can't abuse the system. Well, I think this guy sells health items, right? Yeah, endo upgrades. Oh, we can't afford any of them. It's a shame. Nightmare Freddy! The more the merrier, he's so cute. Okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and get the Neon Bee, that'll be nice. Select up to four bites to activate. Okay. Cool. Phantom Mangle, because she needed to be weirder. Alright, let's actually play this game now. Because <laughs> we have not been. And here we are, our first battle against Gear Rat. Um, Cupcake. And... Bite! Hook! Oh, and Freddy already died. <laughs> oh my gosh, these guys are freaking strong! What the heck? Okay, I need to be faster about this. Oh, those healed everybody! Okay, I forgot about that. What's munchies? Oh, those are good. Am I gonna die on my first battle, man? I mean, yeah, I am in hard mode. That was a lot of levels. <laughs> that was a lot of levels. Uh, okay. Can we heal now? Oh, are we automatically healed after each battle? I can't remember. Um... Let's just assume so? Dang, this is, um... <clears throat> Really gonna be hard mode, isn't it? How do I get to this? Uh, I feel like if we talk to him, we're gonna get involved in something that we shouldn't get involved in yet, but let's do it anyway. I think I found a clue as to what is happening. Look behind me, there's a tree that is distorted and glitched. You don't know as much as I do, but I will tell you that this is a safe haven, a sanctuary. Whatever has gone wrong, we have to fix it. It will be an adventure! Something horrible must have happened on the flip side, because it's causing this world to fracture. 
objects like the tree behind me have broken. But I think you can use the, these fractures to get to places you couldn't reach before. You have to go and find the source of these fractures. Okay. But you were telling me not to believe you a minute ago, so... Yes, the world beneath the surface world. This is a safe place, a sanctuary. The truth is that there is no safe place. You don't understand that. You are made for one thing. There is a task for you to complete. Before you follow this passage, go back. Find the clock. Will do! Will do! Will do! Will do! Chica! Okay. Oh no! Okay, pizza wheel! I love pizza wheel, it's so cute. Alright, cupcakes. I don't even know if we needed that yet. I don't... I, I don't know what... Happy Jam does? Oh, jump scare is nice. It kind of like stops them for a little bit. Bash jam. Oh, okay. Oh, I was gonna use my healing. Okay, hot cheese. <laughs> oh. Okay, this guy has got to be almost dead. Wait, did it? Um, so is only my s Oh no! Okay! Phantom Freddy! He's gonna try and wreck our team, so I need to be careful. Oh, we need to heal. We need to heal real fast. Don't hit Chica, please. Party favors! Oh, that was not the healing thing that I thought it was. Oh! Bash Jam? Is that what I just used? That one healed. Birthday? Oh, it just ups everyone. That's not really helpful. No, Bash Jam hurts him. Okay. Party Favors only helps us a little bit. No, I shouldn't have used that! Okay, just use an attack if you're gonna survive. Okay, well, that didn't go super well. Water hose? We did it! We got Phantom Freddy! Oh my gosh! Okay, who are we getting rid of? Level one. Oh. Five, four, four. Oh, I guess when we were leveling up, our second team, it was actually leveling up the first team, too, so that's good. So, level one is not gonna be great. However, actually, I don't really like his attacks very much. Gloom Song is an actual attack. Rainy Day, I think, is a slow attack that's, that happens over time. Sludge might be a, a slow attack that happens over time as well. I don't know. I think? That's not bad. You know, let's just switch him out for regular Freddy. Sure. Let's see how we do. Fredbear, where it all started. Okay, we need to find the clock and also not die. Okay, let's try Gloom Song. What does that do? Oh, it brings attack down. That's nice. That's not bad. Bounce pot! Party favors is... Regen song. Okay, party favors makes everyone's attacks go up. Yay! That was really easy for some reason. Look at these wacky freaking castles. They are wild. Dee Dee is back! Can I go make some money? You know, if I can do it again. Yeah! Right here, right here, right here. <sighs> okay, I just made my money back. That didn't really work super well, but that's okay. Okay, let's go find a clock and also continue leveling up. It was right there. Okay. That was easy. The question is, what do I do again? I don't, I hope I don't mess this up. Let's save right now. Do I just have to push Balloon Boy into the box? Yeah, I think that's all I have to do. We did it! Okay! Oh, 
Ooh, there's another there's another little bit. Gear rat. Oh joy, these guys are kinda hard. Sludge. Oh slow It literally says what they are down there. Okay. Lowers enemy attack power. Slows them down. Eh. Heal all party members. Yeah, let's do that. Low damage bite. Low damage all enemies. Okay. Sure. Low damage hook attack. Stuns enemies for a few seconds. Let's slow them down again. Let's just make them real slow. Uh, refills life during battle. So that's like a slow heal? I guess? Lowers enemy defense. So, yeah, all Phantom Freddy does is debuffs, and that's about it. Which is fine. I just don't see him as being a staple. I don't think he's- I don't think he's gonna be on our team for very long. I'm not much of a... Tactical? What would you even call it? Logical? Smart video game player? I like attack. <laughs> I like attack and that's it. Hello! Medpod. These medpods will heal you during battles. Okay, well, let's go ahead and just buy the cheap one, huh? Yay! Hey, her pals! I forgot they were in this game. Oh, is this a dead end? So, I know that there's like certain bricks you can walk through. Head start speed! Ooh! Okay. Start battle with a temporary speed boost. Ah, I'm down. Hmm. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be scary. Why did I heal immediately? That's a terrible idea. That's okay. Let's lower their attack power, please. Thank you. Damage over time effect. Um, let's lower your defenses too. Happy jam, heal all party members. Okay, sure. Low damage plus healing. Oh. That's kind of cool. Cheek is very useful, I swear. Okay, stun him. We're doing really good this time, like, we're not even losing any health. We might be getting to the point where we're too high of level for this area. Which is good! It means we're kicking butt. Alright, I'm gonna see if I can find hurts my brain. <laughs> I was gonna say, I'm gonna see if I can find, um, like a hidden path here, but, uh, all I found was that. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's Phantom Spaz Boy! <laughs> oh my gosh, he freaking murdered, uh, who is that? Whose health is that? Is that Chica? Okay, we uh, definitely need to like debuff this guy because he is murdering our team. Health 16 for a minute there. Okay, now he is like completely useless, I think. Poppers, explosive in high numbers. Oh, that doesn't even matter because that's for like multiple. Okay, kills all en enemies under 30% health. No way! That's so cool! I swear, the first time I played that, it didn't have those little, like, descriptions of the attacks on the bottom, I don't think. Maybe I was just blind back then. Alright, new party members. Should we... Should we add Balloon Boy? Toxic Balloon. Gloom Balloon. Rainy Day. He's pretty much exactly like Phantom Freddy, like, just debuffs, mainly. Oh my gosh. Playing video games with these freaking nails, man. Such a pain in the butt. And I am not normally the kind of person that has these types of nails. Oh? Toxic Balloon. I didn't even read what it did, but it did something. 
Yeah, I got these nails because uh, my sister just got married, and I was a maid of honor, which was really scary. I had to do a speech and everything. Crazy stuff. Alright, I want to look at his attacks. Inflicts enemy with poison. Cool, cool. Lowers enemy attack power, of course. And rainy day, which we already know, so... I think Phantom Balloon Boy is probably better than Phantom Freddy because he actually can inflict some damage. Hello, um... Chipper's house, probably. Oh, Mech Crab! Um... Mech... Mech... Mech Crab. Mech Crab. It's been a while since I've seen those goofy little things. It's so weird that there was a bootleg toy of that character, like, such a weird character for them to make a toy on. There's so many obscure and weird characters in this game. JJ! Okay, that's interesting. Wonder if she'll be difficult. Well, she is trying to murder our team. Oh, she murdered Bonnie. Oh! We killed her! That wasn't that bad! This is hard mode? I'm doing pretty good. Alright, JJ, what kind of attacks do you got? Balloons... I don't remember what that does. Poppers, cool. Unscrew, I think that's actually a really good attack. Alright, let's just start making um, an annoying child party. Let's get rid of Bonnie for now. <laughs> Alright. Don't worry, these teams will become more refined in time. For now, they're just gonna be weird. Unscrew, 30% chance to kill one enemy. Oh! Okay, it's a chance attack, so it doesn't actually hurt them at all unless it actually works. But I remember having a lot of fun with that one, so I'm still gonna use it on occasion. Oh? Yes! Our Balloon Boy party is coming together! <laughs> this is exciting. Alright, can we murder you? It worked! Oh my gosh, yes! That's amazing. Ah! Alright. I guess Foxy's gonna deal with the Balloon Boys. He's just gonna have to be a part of that party for now. What kind of attacks you got? Balloons, hot cheese, munchies. Okay, cool, cool. I like that. Toy Bonnie, he's so cute. So cute. Am I stuck? Okay. Kind of. <laughs> ah, let's try out our new attacks. Three random damage hits. That's kind of fun. Um, munchies, hot cheese. I like the balloons, those are fun. Because you could hit them really hard if you're lucky. And I like luck. Obviously, I'm talking about gambling. I personally think that gambling fake money is totally fine. I am not endorsing gambling with real money. Absolutely not. Oh? Phantom Chica! The animations though. Oh, she's murdering. Okay. So it's gonna be like that. She is... Oh, okay, okay. Okay, that wasn't so bad. Do we want her? Yes. Our first team is going to be Balloon Boy Team. And our second team is going to be Phantom Team. So let's start moving some of these characters around. Toxic Bite! And Unscrew, that's fun. Okay, we got kind of a weird team situation going on here, but it'll be fun for now. Let's go gamble, and then we'll take care of the chipper, auto chipper. Yeah, so here's our first team. Uh, we got balloon kids and toys. And then our second team, mainly phantoms. Uh, it will be fully phantom at some point, but not now, not yet. That was dumb. That was dumb of me. <laughs> oh, she's still there. <gasps> no way. Oh, I thought it was gonna give it to me immediately. Dang. Yeah! 
Yeah, yeah, yeah! Oh my gosh! I'm rich! <laughs> okay, what can we buy? I mean, I could buy that, but I don't want that. I kind of... I kind of want um, an endo upgrade, so let's go do that. Mendo! I can't afford it yet. Oh, totem mole! You know, I don't think we've seen these guys yet. I wonder if they're actually difficult to kill. Nope. Yeah! <laughs> oh my gosh. Ooh, Nightmarian. 370 coins. Wow. Let's go get an endoskeleton. Oh, they're so expensive. Okay, well, should we spend it on the... Or should we... I mean, it's gonna take forever to get to 1500. Let's just let's just buy the cheap one for now. It's not a big deal. Yay! More defense. Ooh, a chest. Hello. All right, let's do it. Auto chipper. Let's throw on some munchies, some hot cheese. Try and unscrew every single time, cause why not? Well, actually, he's almost dead. Oh yeah, he was easy. I am uh, very overleveled for this area. But we did it! Our very first mini-boss! Okay, that was, um... That was easy. Head Start Strength, okay. A new chip? Cool. Spring Trap, we're definitely gonna have him on our team. There's no doubt. All right, let me check them walls. And we get a chest. Ten tokens. Nothing too special. And a big chest. Head start defense. Oh my gosh. We're gonna be full on chips pretty soon. <laughs> oh, wow. All right, that was our last time gambling in this area because we... We finished. We finished this area. It's time to go through the glitched um, thingamajig and move on into a more difficult area where we can run into new characters. Because we are murdering, massacring everything around here. We got the clock, so we're all good to go. Let's do it! Oh, I forgot how mazy this can be. I remember my first time playing this game, I drew out maps everywhere around here because it was so confusing. Let's not go into the first entryway and see what else there is. Cause I have a feeling it could drop us into like a chest area or something, if we have patience. Why don't I ever use this song in my videos? Cause it's kinda good. I should, I should. That is something I'm going to do. Okay, we made it to the second entry point. Should we just go into there? I guess so. Oh, I feel like the other entry point would have got me to that chest. Uh, I think we can go back later, so I don't know if it matters. Maybe we can even go back right now. I'm on a mission to collect all the things in this game. Where are we going to appear? Next to a chest? Oh. All right. <laughs> Moving on. Fred Bear, what do you have? to say for yourself. Great! Be sure to press that button behind you to clear the path for later. That way you won't have to take the long way again. I think that a lot of these monsters are misguided side effects of whatever has happened on the flip side. It looks like you can knock some sense into them and they'll join you. How wonderfully convenient. You need to find another subtunnel under the game. And it's probably hidden inside another glitched object. 
Ahead are the dusting fields. You will probably find the next glitched object there. Be careful, things only get more dangerous from here. Thanks for the advice! Things don't get more dangerous, you are being played. Well, actually they do, don't they? You're being led through hoops. Meanwhile, the puppet master is laughing at you. Is that Scott? You need to find the dusting fields, but not because that there is any urgent adventure ahead. Find the clock. Will do, will do. Um, but you're also wrong because it does get more dangerous ahead. But okay. Hello, bird. Um, I know you're important later or something. Or something. Oh, there's a mine ahead. We can go into that mine. Does that mine connect with all the other mines? Because I know that that is a huge, huge maze. I don't imagine it does connect. Not yet. So, should we check it out is the question? Let's do it! Mysterious mine. Hold tab to view the map. I forgot how freaking confusing this map is. Let's not even look at it. Let's just do what... What we're doing. I just went in a circle. Mysterious mine, what do you have inside? What kind of secrets are you hiding? Metal mans! Which are probably- oh, yeah, murdering me, actually. Nice. Oh, Bonnie's got- He died. Oh my gosh, I'm getting massacred! Balloon boy, you can do it! Nope. We need to lower their attacks, like, immediately. Oh, we're gonna die. Mike Toss as your last attack! Wow. Well... We didn't kill a single one of those! Oh my gosh! Alright, skipping ahead. I, uh, kind of want to go back into that mine. I think we got really unlucky because running into four metal men is kind of insane. I don't think that's gonna happen very often. I mean, I know this guy's really strong too, but we ran into one. Very different than running into four. Our prize ball just had another munchie in it. I have so much fun with those, I don't know why. Oh, he finally died! Holy crap. We didn't even level up? Bro, he was so hard to kill. Maybe it's, um... Not a good idea for us to be in here. Maybe not. Oh no. <laughs> Withered Foxy, oh my gosh. Um, he might be incredibly strong, so that's concerning. There goes Bonnie. Unscrew? Nope. Well, he's getting hurt a lot, so that's good. Unscrew? Yes! Yes! He was not that hard to beat. Okay. We got real lucky. We have a new party member! Our first withered! Okay, who were we switching out then? Um, let's put him with the first team. Might as well. Hook, rainy day, hot cheese two! Hot cheese two! I like that. Okay, I think I figured out that this mysterious mine is really just a dead end. So we went up, it's a dead end. We went left, it's a dead end. We went left another- Oh, okay, let's go all the way down and left because it looks like there actually is something down there. And let's check out Wither Foxy, huh? Hot cheese two? Uh, okay, right- 
So that's the only interesting attack he has, but drops a lot more hot cheese, so that's nice. And this gold mine is taken forever to go down. Absolutely forever. All right, I'm switching back to the other team. <laughs> I think they generally can do more damage, especially with all the balloons. The balloons do a surprisingly large amount of damage. And it's always unscrew, I swear. <laughs> Good job, JJ. You are the MVP. Okay, there should be something over here. According to the map. A mini boss! Oh, let's switch to our debuff team first. I'm just gonna treat him like he's gonna murder us. So. We need to lower his attack next. I always forget which one does which. Okay, um, his health is going down really fast, so maybe he's not that difficult, actually. Oh yeah, he is getting absolutely murdered. That was actually really easy! Goodbye, Mr. Eyesore! What a funny boss. And we got a gold chest. Endless speed. Permanent speed boost. Oh, I love that. Beautiful. On to dusting fields we go. Oh, there's a mini boss up there. Um, yeah, okay, okay. Hello there, mister. Mr. Auto Chipper, can we unscrew you on the first try? Nope. That would have been funny. Aw, oh, jump scare. Fine, I'm switching then. I think I'm worried about that. Oh, uh, the switch- the switch, um, ability is kind of OP. I have a feeling, even on hard mode, I might wreck this game. Kick its butt. Ever comet weak. Ever- oh! Oh my gosh, I remember those! Those are so nice! Those are so, so nice. They like shoot down a comet every once in a while and just destroy enemies. May occasionally fall. Okay, what are we getting rid of? Let's get rid of... Defense? How do I... Oh, I have to reset. Okay, yeah, let's get rid of defense. We got an endo. I don't think we need it. Withered body. Alrighty. Let's actually go to dusting fields now. Wait a second, how do I get to that? Oh, through a tent. That's not till later. Here we go! Flan! Oh my gosh, he's so goofy, I love him. They're also terrifying looking. Amazing. My balloon team is actually pretty powerful. I'm, I'm proud of it. We've come a long way. Here we are. Oh, there's a mini boss down there. Hey, wait. Did we? How do you get a key? Did we ever open that one locked spot on area one? Did we? Oh. No, we did not. There's still a- There's still a lock there. How do we do that? Do you find keys in this game? I don't remember finding keys in this game. Well, considering that there's a button, maybe it just means that we can't go there yet. Okay. Quick start party. 
What does that do? Your party has the element of surprise. Oh, what? Oh, I guess it means that we get to start faster than the enemy that we're dealing with. Which is better though? Head start speed or quick start party? Start battle with temporary speed boost. Your party has the element of surprise. We already got endless speed. So maybe we should just do that. I don't really know what it does compared to speed, but okay. JJ, because one wasn't enough. I actually like JJ. JJ just sits under your desk and chills, unlike Balloon Boy. There's the cloak! Okay. Hello? What are you selling? Reapers! These reapers have a chance to instantly kill enemies. Haha, <laughs> I love it, we're buying it. All right. We are getting some serious damage boosters. Box bite! Oh my gosh. One of the most hideous characters in the game. All right, we didn't lose anybody, so that's not so bad. Box bite! He's not strong. He's weak. Oh, we got a gold chest. 50, not bad? Okay. What do I do this time? No idea, let's save first. Oh, I think I just flipped the switches and that's it. I'm glad these aren't too confusing because we have such a short period of time to do them. That takes care of that. Chillax! Oh, they're so spastic! This game, there is so much... So many spazzing characters in this game. So many. They're all just hyped up on sugar. And caffeine. Actually, same. There we go. Alrighty, how do we get down to that chest? Oh wait, we already been there before. Hello, Fredbear! The subtunnel must be up ahead. However, it looks like something is blocking the path. I'm sure it's nothing you can't handle. I do need to warn you of something, though. When you enter a glitched object into a subtunnel, it's possible to find yet another glitched object inside. That will take you into a subtunnel beneath the subtunnel. There may even be more glitched objects there. Just be sure to never go more than three glitches down. I'm not sure if you would find your way back up. Be sure to always search for new chips and bites. They will be a huge help against monsters like the one up ahead. Never go down too deep. Play along for now. You're being pulled on a string for his amusement. Don't enter the glitch yet. You need to go into the mine. Find the clock. Will do. Will do. And we got a mini boss. Let's do it. Bouncer. All right, let's um let's get some debuffs in here. For just in case he's a pain in the butt. And some hot cheese too. Should melt him real quick. All right, he's already completely debuffed, so we can just start throwing attacks at him now. Oh my word. Except for the fact that not all those characters can even attack. Unscrew. Can we do it? Oh. I did not mean to use poppers because he's almost dead. That was easy. How am I this overpowered right now? It's not like I was grinding, not purposely grinding. No, that's not what I meant to do. Restarting. <laughs> yeah, you can actually only just barely tell that that is a glitched object. I just walked right into it. <laughs> I love the Ferris wheel though. It's so cute. It's so random. This game is so random. I love it. 
And then there's the weird dancing Freddy. I forgot about that. Everyone was so confused by that for the longest time and we never got an answer. I'm pretty sure we never got an answer for what is up with that dancing Freddy and also you can't get over to it. You can't get to it at all, I don't think. It's so weird. You know, it's kind of funny, but that looks like glam rock Freddy. <laughs> Cause like how his torso like goes down and gets thinner. That's what that looks like. Glam rock Freddy, what are you doing? What are you doing here? So weird, man. So weird. I'm pretty dang sure you can't get to him. All right, into the mine we go. And save. Time to find us a clock. I'm gonna start by going to the right, and that's a dead end immediately. Okay, up. Hello. All right, that is also a dead end. And that is also a dead end. And... Okay. Up and to the right are both dead ends. So I guess our only option is to the left. There's our clock. And we just gotta push the cupcakes into the boxes. Easy peasy. Ooh, gold chest. Oh no, four gold mines. Oh boy. This is gonna be interesting. Whew! That uh, gave me a little spook. I was worried there for a second. We good, we good. Withered body! Ah! Oh wait, why do I... Okay. <laughs> Yay! Yeah, we unscrewed him immediately! Heck yeah! Ah, oh, we're collecting our withered team! Except, what about the phantoms? We need our other phantoms. Oh well, oh well. I don't remember how to get that, but that's interesting. Here we go, eyesore. Unscrew to 50% chance. Dang, that's actually super neat. Oh, he got murdered immediately. I mean, he is pro- Do they all start at level one? I guess I'm not surprised. We're gonna switch teams and get some damage going here. Okay, cool. Not bad, not bad at all. Hopefully we get to level up with it Bonnie a little bit for that. Surely, surely it did. Gold chest! Auto gift boxes. Wait, isn't what is gift boxes again? Your party begins each battle with an extra life. Oh, this this one is so good. I loved this one. Oh my gosh, yes. Okay, what are we getting rid of? Let's get rid of Quick Start Party because I really don't know what that is. <laughs> I don't know what it is, so I'm avoiding using it. I forgot about gift boxes, man. Those are so useful. It means your characters can come back to life. Okay, so it looks like there's a smaller gift box right here. Is that what that I was, is that what I was seeing? Right in here? Yeah, yeah, okay. And there might be something way down at the bottom. Unscrew two. Nice! Withered Bonnie is super useful. And look at we all got gift boxes, so it's like, we don't even have to care no more. I don't even gotta try no more. I beam, medium damage, chance of critical hit. Such a strange attack. <laughs> Withered Bonnie is just like shooting lasers out of his eyes. Pizza wheel, I like that one. Dang.
All right, I get the feeling that we're done in this mine, so moving on. Let's go ahead and hit up that glitched object and get going. You know, once we deal with these lovely box fights. All right, back here again. Now these trees, when you can go through them, don't they like flash a certain type of way? The ones that you can go through? I don't know, I don't remember. All I know is that it can get real tricky inside these guys. At the very least, this game has been out for a long time, which means there should be maps that we can follow later. And I guess we're going in this one. Oh, <laughs> oh, that was so useful. Oh, Phantom Foxy. Yay, we're getting our phantoms. Actually, our phantom team will be ready. It'll be complete. I mean, obviously there's more, there's um, at least one or two more phantoms left, but still we'll have a full four. Also, he was extremely easy to destroy. <laughs> so there's that. Yay, jump scare, toxic bite, unscrew. Okay, cool, cool. So, Wizard Fra Foxy, we are taking you off the team. Which means you're taking Mangle's position, because that is now going to be the balloon slash withered team for the time being. Alright, last time I went down, so let's not go down, because that led us to nowhere. Oh, time to go into a glitch deeper. And also, the music is so fun. Ah, let's get out of here. Thank you. Okay. That should take us out. Yay! Oh, we're going to Lily Gear now. Boop. All right, Fredbear. Hello. You've reached Lily Gear Lake. From here, I don't know where your adventure will take you. You should be keeping your eyes open for another glitched object. They are the only way to get to places that are otherwise unreachable. Be careful in the waters of Lily, Lily Gear Lake. I hear there is a sea monster that attacks at random. Be ready to fight. Good luck. At random? That's fun. Reminds me of the troll edition. <laughs> the random mini bosses. Yes, well, everything attacks at random, doesn't it? Kind of. The one who pulls the strings is always watching. He allows you to progress. Follow the trail that they have created for you. Play along. There is another mine that you must find before you enter the glitched object. Find the clock. Oh joy, we're going into another mine. Jacko Chica, feeling empty inside. Aww. Poor Jacko Chica. Alright. Ah, look at us! Colossal! Really beautiful squid. Very beautiful. Question is, how strong is he gonna be? Well, not strong. Not really. I mean, he did kill Wizard Foxy once, but... You're gonna have to kill our team members twice now. Honestly, hard mode is not that hard. <laughs> Freddy looks so silly. Oh my gosh. Crab apple. Another enemy that is just so beautiful. You know what's weird? I think about this game, I feel like if Scott went for more of a pastel look, I think the game in general would, would look better. Because these characters, like, their colors are so saturated, it kind of burns your eyes a little bit. It comes across as very much a child's game, which, sure, sure. But a FNAF World is like the most childish game in the entire series, I would say. But holy crap, the... The- oh my gosh, it's the boss! Oh. 
See you, goon. You are not that strong, my guy. I like his eyebrows, though. <laughs> oh, actually, he did actually manage to off one character. Wow. Impressive. A boss that offed a single character. I actually remember this game being way harder than this. But I'm not complaining, it's still a lot of fun to play. And we got Pig Patch, oh my gosh. He's so weird looking. Ah, another Colossal, all right, skip. We ran, successfully. Um, this is probably where the mine is on land, I would imagine. And maybe something else? That's a glitch tree that we do not want to touch yet. What are you locking me out of exactly? Weird. Alright, we're gonna start by going right. Oh, this one's a little bit more mazy than normal. Actually, screw you, I'm running. I don't have time for this. And I also don't need experience right now. Although, I need to go back and buy that med pack, because I can actually afford it now. No. Oh! Hello! What am I trying to do? What if I did that wrong? Oh crap. I gotta- I gotta look it up. That's the password from FNAF 3! That you type into the wall, isn't it? Was it like 3-9? I don't remember it. I don't remember what it was. Alright, let's hope that the save worked out okay and I can get back in. Bro, what? Oh, I'm- I think I did it wrong! Alright, let's not worry about it. If I can't get the clock ending on my first attempt, then we'll get it later. I'll just redo it. it it'll be fine, it'll be fine. It's not a big deal. I can speedrun this game. You know, if I do lots of- running like I'm doing now. Hmm. That sucks, man. Did I really go and mess that up? Yes. I'm pretty sure I stood on one that said like 15 something. That is absolutely not what we need. Okay. Oh, hello, little bit. Welcome to Little Bit's Bite Store. These shields block base damage from all attacks. So, they're shields. Okay. Would I rather have the nicer med pack? Nah, let's just buy this. It doesn't really matter. Alright, we have all four items. Ooh, uh, 50 tokens. Thank you. <laughs> well, that was embarrassing for him. He's like, what? Dead. Oh my gosh, this is the one! This is the one where we battle Chipper, isn't it? Okay, I'm gonna periodically be checking the map. It says we should be able to turn right here. Go away, I don't have time for you right now. Oh! Shadow Freddy! Oh my gosh! Yay! I love Shadow Freddy! We're gonna cheese him up. Nope. Yay! Oh my gosh! Okay, how are we adjusting our teams now? That's the question. Hmm. Let's find out. 
Oh, look at him. He's so spooky. And a little derpy, but we love him. Well, I would put him on my phantom team because he kind of matches their vibe. However, our phantom team is full. So let's, let's drop, I know we've had the balloon team for a long time, but I think it's time to let go of the balloon team and move on to greater things. So let's go ahead and put Shadow Freddy on our first team and balloon boy, goodbye. It's been good. But who should we have on our number one team now? It's Withered plus Shadow. We could do Mangle for now. I really like Mangle. Go straight up and then we can turn right at some point. Oh, we can turn left at some point and there's a boss in there. I remember now. I think it's just a nice ore. All right, let's check out our attacks for Shadow Freddy. Unscrew, okay. Escape key, chance to kill multiple enemies. Oh, I love that attack. I used to use that all the time. Water hose, okay. It didn't work. It's still cool though! Oh my gosh. Such a fun character to have on your team. Just random chances of murdering people. And we're just gonna keep dropping more cheese. <laughs> further up right here okay so that didn't do anything for us oh we mi we skipped it okay it's further down like right around here right no further did I get in there I don't think so for whatever reason, I can't get in there right now. So we gonna walk away and do it another time. Um, it seems like we can still go up and do more stuffs. Wow, we can actually see Freddy again. Okay, there's nothing there. Hmm. Hello, a little bit. Ah, go away! I need like a repel from Pokemon or something. It's like, sure, I'll kill all these guys, but I don't need that much experience because I don't want the game to be extremely easy. Ooh, endless strength, like we need that. Uh, let's not use it for now. I don't think we need it right now. Maybe in the future, if the game starts getting harder, then we'll use it. But for now, I think we good. Oh, there's a boss up here. Mr. Isawa, hello. I wonder if unscrew and, um, Escape key actually work on Eyesore, on a boss. I don't really know. <clears throat> I wonder how much this does. I don't know if it actually hurt him at all. Because he's not under 30%. Oh well. Look at our phantom team! It's so cool. Alright, bro. You're making me bored. Die already. Alright, he's almost done. Hooray! I imagine we're gonna get a chip. Endless defense. 
We are out of here. And let's just run because these guys are weak. Come on. Little treasure chest. Oh, there's a gold chest. I think that's 50. I'll take that. Alright, back onto the lake. Run from the weakling! There we go. Whee! We got some bosses to defeat over here. There's another key. I don't really know how the keys work. Okay, we made light of that. I am pretty sure that there's things that we can go through here. What is that? Oh, that's a... Um, a little whirlpool portal thing, if I remember correctly. Oh, we ran into the boss again. This guy is a boss, isn't he? Yes, he has the boss health health bar. Well, that was easy. We didn't even get any money for that. Come on. What's up here? Oh, this is our little portal thing. Should we go to it now? I guess. Drip! Oh, what is this? I must check this first. Huh. I don't know. I mean, that's gonna take us to the circus? Already? Oh, we skipped a glitched object. Whoa. What? I guess I just entered the side of the tent. Oh! <laughs> yeah, I guess I did. Here we are. Where are we going to go is the question. Alright, to the left. Let's find out if we made the right choice. We made the wrong choice. <laughs> Alright, to the right this time. And it's splitting up again. Let's keep left. It's probably gonna be wrong. Yeah, at least we got a treasure chest. Alright, keeping right. Okay, we can go deeper or we can... Alright, let's check our exit first before we go deeper. It might be a chest. You never know. We was fooled again! <laughs> Alright, we are going deeper this time. And our way out. Are the paths gonna branch again? No, there's only one way to go. Okay, good. So that should take care of that. We should unlock a new area. Black Tomb Yard. Yeah, five. I wonder if Pinwell Circus even has a number. I don't know. I'm overthinking it. Let's talk to Fredbear. This is a horribly spooky place. I think I'll stay right here. You, however, need to keep going. This is a graveyard for broken and unwanted creations. It's full of nastiness and traps. I don't think everything here is as it seems. Check the graves and the trees. This whole place is full of illusion. Oh boy. Lots of things we can walk through. One thing is true. Nothing here is as it seems. You need to find another clock, but the passage will not be easy. There's a secret sub-corridor that leads to Pinwheel Circus under this graveyard. Find the clock. Everything else is a deception. But I screwed up the last one! So it's all pointless! 
We'll do it anyways, just for practice. Oh, hello! Bear trap! Huh. Very nice. Uh, we do actually do have a bear on our team. I wonder if he's... He's weakened. I wonder if he's more vulnerable to this enemy. Question is, how weak are you? Very. 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 I'm really tempted to go back to Pinwheel Circus first. Because the passage was there. Let's do it. Alright. Let's go find out what this is all about. Hello, little bit- oh, wait a minute. Ah! <laughs> it was literally just a shop. I can't actually get in there. Well, good to know, good to know. What is the shop? UFOs. They shoot lasers for very high damage. Crap, we don't have any money. I mean, we could get a mini UFO, but I don't know if that's worth it. Alright, well, we came, we saw, now we leave. Alright, so there's a lot of invisible walls. I wonder if the map shows the invisible walls. Maybe. I'm starting to wonder if I should take off all these like little added guys. Our uh, bites, I think they're called? I wonder if we should just take them off because then it would make the game harder. And right now, it's so easy that I'm falling asleep. Let's do it. Let's take them off. Treasure! I like treasure. Thank you for that. Prototype! Hello! I missed you guys. I like these fun little characters. Once the characters start looking more like FNAF characters, I start liking them more. <laughs> because, um... There's a lot of really weird characters in this game that I don't care for. Escape! Alright, so these guys are definitely seemingly a lot more strong. In fact, they're so strong, I wish I had a healer on my team. I, I'm surprised I don't. We still have the gift boxes though, which is making this pretty easy. We did lose our entire team, but because of the gift boxes, we're fine. Yeah, okay. So it's harder, but it's not hard yet. So you know what that means. Reset. We're getting rid of gift boxes. The only thing that I want Let's do... Let's just do speed and that's it. Let's just do speed. That's it. See if it makes it a little bit more difficult. Surely it will. Without having gift boxes, we're m way more likely to die. And actually end up using our second team more often. Because right now we don't use them at all. Block jump scare. What is that? Makes you immune to jump scare. Oh, okay, we'll take that too. Because jump scare is annoying anyways. All it does is slow everything down. Uh, that's an entry to a mine right there, I think. Hello, little bit. What do you got? Bombs. Detonate once per battle for instant damage. Cool. But... And for now, let's just buy the cheap one and just because I'm collecting the items, I'm not using them right now. Hmm. Oh, four bear traps. Okay, let's see what happens then. <laughs> Alright, I gotta keep a closer eye on my health now that it's a little bit more difficult. Although, there's no healers on my first team and that's kind of a problem. Hopefully we run into a healing character soon. Like Withered Chica, she probably heals. I bet we'll see her soon. Oh, I was like, did I call it? No. Not bad. 
Phantom Mangle! Yay! Well, she's not doing a ton of damage right now. Although we did lose a character! Yeah! Nice, Phantom Freddy. Good job. Sorry, Shadow Freddy. You know. Yay! Okay. So let's get rid of Phantom Balloon Boy because no one cares about Balloon Boy. <laughs> Virtua Freddy! I forgot about him! I wish he was an actual character. I think he's just an attack. Or something. He's like a bite or something like that. Okay, we're gonna have to start looking for invisible walls because, uh, I already walked around this whole place. <laughs> what am I missing? What am I missing? I walked- to oh my gosh, that's what I was missing. Okay, finally. <laughs> You'd think I'd remember these things, but heck, this game came out, what, 27? 2018? 2019? No, 2019, I think. A long time ago. All right, into the mine we go. Deep metal mine. Now we're supposed to find a glitched object so that we can get to the next clock, but oh well, we're going into a mine instead. Tomb stack. Huh, cool, I like them. All right, I wanna use our new character. Phantom Mangle! Um, I don't know who I'm using right now. I'm using Foxy. She's got Pizza Wheel too! Very nice. That is sick. Oh my gosh! Okay, this is serious. This is serious now! <laughs> oh, Phantom Freddy's dead! We're all about to die! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Ah! Oh no. Oh no, we just lost our unscrew too. Come on, Mango! Come on, Mango! Okay. I like that. It's getting harder, and I like that. Back into the mine we go, which is gonna be apparently very dangerous because we got massacred very quickly. I remember this mine as being very hard. Rot. I don't think these guys are gonna be that bad, but I guess we'll find out. Oh! We got a death already. Oh my gosh. Maybe they are gonna be really hard. Oh, I see. I'm just gonna keep trying to unscrew because I don't know what else to do. I think that's our best chance of living. What? Oh, that was weird. Ah! Oh, we were so close. Come on, yes! We survived! Barely. <laughs> All right, what's up here? We got a key and a grave. Okay, so that direction is a dead end. And another grave. Oh boy, more rot. All right, let's not screw around this time. It could be very dangerous. Oh, we- oh, we're murdering him this time. Okay, I really- it's the unscrew. That's what it is. It's carrying us. Okay, not bad. We are, um, leveling up and it's starting to get easier, so that's good. Got ourselves a torch. 
which is emitting no light. <laughs> Wonderful. Oh! Um. Hmm. I didn't mean to go into that. I didn't know that was glitched, but okay. Okay, we're gonna go up first. Um... Oh, it's a circle. It's a circle. Oh, we can go deeper. No, let's not go deeper. Let's see what's... Oh. I guess we can't, because that's our only option. Okay. Deeper it is! We're gonna go left. And there's an exit out, okay. Um... Oh! We gotta go deeper again, okay. This is where it gets a little bit confusing, isn't it? Let's go left again. Um. Whoa, wait, did we just go in a circle? Oh, we did. Wait a second, am I... Can I... Can't I get out of this one? I feel like I can get out of this one. I just don't remember it. Oh, that's so trippy. It kind of hurts my eyes a little bit. I feel like a Tamagotchi. There's a way out! Okay. Now where do we go? We're coming out, we're coming out! Ah! It out. Oh my goodness. That was a little tricky. That was definitely a little tricky. Dog fight. Okay, so we're in Pinball Circus now. Um, I didn't mean to get through the mine that fast. I, I imagine there's still more to see in there, but we'll go check it out later. For now, we're in Pinball Circus. Oh, there's so many of them. Oh, that was... Oh, it was unscrew. I was gonna say, that was easy. Whoa! That was a high damage attack right there. Oh, that wasn't too bad, though. We got pretty lucky with them unscrews. Alright, some tents you can go into. But other tents you cannot, if I remember correctly. Oh, and there's a mine right beside us, that's interesting. All right, let's see if we can just take him out right away. Yeah. Can't go into that tent. We got three options here. Uh, we can't go into any of them, okay. What about this one? Nope. Three ball boys again. That shouldn't be a problem. Wasn't before. Ho ho ho! Ooh. 
Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, I might die. I'm probably gonna die. Oh my gosh. Come on, Chica. Come on. Well, she took one with her, but it wasn't enough. Okay, three ball boys is no joke. Now we know. M meringue. Okay, cute. Shouldn't have a problem with Meringue, especially since he's alone. Yep. Wow, we defeated the cake. We're so strong. I can defeat a cake pretty easily myself. Endo plush. Ah, what a cutie! And we murdered him immediately. Thank you, Wither Bonnie. Okay. We have a new party member. Where is he gonna go? Hmm. I think we're gonna trade him out for Mangle, because we've had Mangle plenty of times in this game. Cute. All right, let's make some progress. Hello, Fredbear. Um, I wasn't able to find the clock, but I don't think it matters because I lost anyway. What if I accidentally did do the clock correctly and I need to go back and get it? I'm going back to the mine. We're gonna go in there, we're gonna see if we can find the clock. Oh! <gasps> Nightmare Freddy! Neon wall! Oh, force field blocks 50% of damage? Holy crap! Endo plush! That's awesome! Alright, let's try out his other attacks. What else he got? I beam. We already know I beam. Nightmare Freddy! Where are we gonna put him? What do we got here? Bite 2. Sludge. Freddles. Oh, the Freddles attack! Oh my gosh! Yeah, let's get rid of Withered Foxy for now. He's been great, but I think it's time for some new blood in here. Like Endo Plush, because character quota. <laughs> Not a problem anymore, Scott. Not a problem anymore. You got a lot of characters now. <laughs> Which is why you should remake FNAF World. Seems like there's something up here. Oh, it's a little bit. That is quite a lot of damage. Man, this uh this neon wall is really helping. I don't think we're gonna get rid of him anytime soon. Oh dang, they're not at half a percent yet. You guys have a lot of health. Dang, we still haven't killed any. That was sick! Nice, Shadow Freddy. I think that was the first time he's ever killed multiple enemies by himself. That was nice. Oh, we were gonna go say hi to a little bit. What do you got? Boss Drain! Oh, these are gonna be so useful, actually. These eye bots work on bosses and steadily drain their life. Well, we can only afford one for now, but we'll come back later. I mean, obviously, when we go against Scott, we probably will want that. There should be something else this direction. Oh, it's a boss! Oh, crap! Okay. Oh, that's not what I meant to do! Oh, I meant to... I meant to use the- oh my gosh, this is gonna be bad. I'm probably gonna die. I meant to use Neon Wall, man! Oh. Ooh, okay. Now we'll, uh, get hurt just a little less. Mad Endo. I like him. Come on, you can do it, Endo Plush! I know you're like- <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely tiny compared to this dude, but oh, he's gonna die now. Okay, let's slow him down. 
Let's do mystery box? I don't know what that's gonna do. Oh, I, that did not help me at all. We gonna die. We've made a tiny dent on his health. Absolutely tiny, tiny dent. <laughs> we might need trusty party members in order to take this guy down. Like, uh, ones that aren't level one. The Phantom Fr Phantom Freddy is always the last one standing, and he does like no- he doesn't- he doesn't no damage attacks! Look at this! He just- at least he's trying, I guess. Alright, let's attempt this boss again. Mad Endo, here we go! Um... Hoppers? I guess I- I forget that Mangle's attacks aren't very good. Maybe we should use our other team first. Oh, oh my gosh! Hello! Yeah, it would be nice if we could debuff a little bit first, and this is going wonderfully. I had auto gift boxes too, and it seemed like it didn't matter. Wait, where is my gift boxes? Did they already all lose them all? Dang, no way. No way it's gone that bad so far. Oh my gosh. Wow. Well, this boss is clearly strong enough for me to use to pull out all the stops. So that's what we're gonna do. Let's get our bites back. We're gonna use health. Uh, we're gonna use a bomb. We're gonna use boss drain. And we're not gonna use the reaper. The stinger might be good, but the shield would also be good. I don't know what the, I think. Let's use the UFO, sure, sure. I will eat your soul. Oh my gosh, okay. Okay, immediately, Neon Wall is what we need. And Freddles! Oh, he is going down fast now. Awesome. We did already lose our gift boxes, though, so that's not great. Let's get a Neon Wall on. Oh, we lost it. That's okay. He's almost dead. He is almost dead! This was way easier. Took four attempts to kill this guy. We had to pull out all of our items. Yeah! Oh, that's a lot of levels. <laughs> Probably the characters that were underleveled. And what did we get? Oh my gosh, yes. We are putting that on right now. More luck finding new characters! Yeah! Okay, let's take off. Um, let's take off gift boxes for now. We're only gonna use those if we absolutely need them. We're also gonna change our bites because we shouldn't be wearing, using any for now. None for now. Not unless we're going up against a boss or actually need it. Sick! Okay, we are pretty much done in this mine. We've gone basically everywhere we can at the moment. So it's time to go back to Pinwheel Circus then. Oh! Marionette! Oh my gosh! Yay! Oh, I'm so excited to have him on our team. Her! Mystery box, let's use it. Sounds like fun. All right, we got a bunch of random characters. We don't have Withered Chica, right? I'm pretty sure we don't. <laughs> it's kind of fun using the mystery box. Prize ball too, what'd we get? Oh, that's not that great. 
Let's uh, regenerate a little bit. Speed song? Whose is that? Oh, it's Toy Freddy's. I haven't used him for so long. I don't remember. All right, Marionette, you are putting up a fight. All right, let's switch teams. I don't like this team that much. Oh! What? Did I switch? Oh! Weird! We got two withered chicas. Uh, and two... Twi oh well. Gotta do what we gotta do. I mean, I, I'm the one who did this. We might actually not live. Maybe I should start using those on less important times. Oh, thank goodness. JJ. The MVP. Back at it again. Goodness. Ah! Alright, what team should we mess around with? Probably our first team, because it's kind of a strange assortment here. I want to get rid of Withered Foxy, kind of. So let's do that. We got a very strange team, number one. Alright. Still Foxy, but more Yarg. Okay. Let's see what we can see. Oh. I don't really want to deal with you right now. The other one did not let us run. It took forever. But... Oh, this chip is doing us favors. Oh my gosh. Plus trap. Okay, who are we getting rid of next? <laughs> mystery box. We're not using mystery box right now. Okay, plus trap is actually really strong too, so... It's kind of a problem. Plus trap, join us! You can be with your buddy! Oh, okay. We did it. I totally forgot to look at um, Marionette's powers. Oh, it's a mystery box. Okay, okay. Gosh, we have two characters with that now. Let's just reset and just start from scratch. Our first team can be made up of these little cuties. Little tiny dudes. Let's do tiny dudes plus balloons. It's been a little bit. And then our other team can just be pretty random. Nightmare Freddy, Marionette, Shadow Freddy, because Shadow Freddy's really useful. Not Withered Foxy. Who should we add? Let's go back to Withered Bonnie. Sure, sure. Like I said, pretty random, but that's okay. I think it'll work out, nonetheless. Oh, here we are! It's been a while. <laughs> Looks like trouble up ahead, but you should be used to that by now. They say that there's a secret funhouse hidden here in the circus. It must be inside one of the tents. I have to warn you, I've seen two giant animatronics roaming the fairgrounds. A giant bear and a giant pig. They look like abominations to me. Also, the funhouse is full of false walls and secret doors. Don't get lost. You're getting close to the core of the game. That's where the problem is. Ooh. Another clock should be inside the funhouse. Nothing else matters. Don't be deceived by the one pulling the strings. And who's that exactly? Scott? Bonnie! Jarman! Jamin. I don't think that's how you pronounce that. Oh, it's Brow Boy. <laughs> it is Brow Boy. Okay, here we go. Time for a boss. Um, hopefully we stand a chance. Bad pizza. Oh, I, I don't know what that did, but neon wall. Oh my gosh, we're getting destroyed. Uh, we're getting absolutely destroyed. We're gonna have to do this one again. I don't want to use bites. 
I don't want to because then it's too easy. Okay, this will give us the opportunity to level up a little bit. Because we got a few characters in here that are a little bit behind, so... Oh, Bad Pizza's definitely better against- whoa! 423 damage?! Plush Trap, holy crap, I'm proud of you. He is strong, cause like, compare it to Balloon Boy, what he's gonna get right now. Well, he did pretty good, actually. Okay, Toxic Bite is nowhere near as good as Bad Pizza, so at least we know that. Toxic Bite, Bad Pizza. Ah, oh, we got a silly little team. Okay, we're coming up on the boss. Let's put those bites on. Definitely this. Ah, oh, this, this, and this. Done. All right, we really shouldn't have a problem this time. Hopefully. Bad pizza! Oh, that's not that much damage. And I shouldn't use unscrew against bosses, because I don't think that works. Oh, I forgot to turn on the chips! Oh my gosh, why did I forget to turn on the chips? Maybe it won't matter? I don't know. Well, we're doing a lot of damage, maybe it won't matter. So we didn't need the chips. <laughs> but we definitely needed the bites. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> well, that was fun. At least we beat him. Moving on. Now we need to start checking some tents and deal with these guys. I'll be right back. Oh, a new challenger! Oh, paper pals! No way! That's super sick. Okay, um, let's try not to die. Alright, um, how about I beam? And bad pizza, of course. <laughs> Plus trap has a really great attack. 400 damage, like dang! Balloon Boy and JJ are a little less useful, but that's okay. Water Hose 2, maybe. No. So they're not even halfway at their health yet. Maybe we can use it now. I bet we could. Alright, water hose too. Still no, they're still not halfway dead. Holy crap, these guys have a lot of health. Keep trying to unscrew, and it worked! That's good, that's good. Because uh, otherwise this would have taken a lot longer. Yay! What team are we putting it on? Well, our second team is very strange. We could definitely take off Withered Bonnie. What kind of attacks do we got? Prize Ball 2? Eh. Mystery Box 2? Uh, eh. Mimic Ball? I don't know what Mimic- Oh! It creates the little Mimic! Okay, I think I remember that. That's actually a really good attack, I think. That's cool. I remember in the past I never played with Paper Pals very much. I'm not sure why, I guess we'll be finding out. Soon enough. 
treasure. Oh. That's three. That's four ball boys. This could be bad. Let's try out our new paper pals real fast. Alright, Mimic Ball. It mimics every attack you do. So it doubles the attacks? Is that what is happening? Oh, he did it again! Wild! How many times does he do it before he disappears? Oh my gosh, we just got murdered. Oh my gosh. Even with the Mimic Ball? Like, dang! Doubling all our attacks and we're still gonna die! Wow. Okay. <laughs> Paper Pals is good, though. Really good. Really nice attacks. Um, kinda sucky that you're level 1 right now, though. <laughs> Chica! Okay! Alright, let's try not to die. Oh, look at her cupcake! I'm so cute! Alright, I kind of want to switch teams. Let's use a um, neon wall one more time and then switch teams. Okay. Let's get the Mimic out here. Use some Freddles. It starts getting wild when you have the Mimic. I mean, absolutely wild. So much happens on the screen at once. It's crazy. Ooh! I don't even know how it died. How she died. But she died! Yay! We have a new Nightmare. Okay. Bite 2. Bad pizza! It's very good. Water host, but it's not water host 2? That's not the best, but bad pizza's really good. So let's get rid of Shadow Freddy because our second team is slowly becoming a nightmare team. Shadow Freddy's been around with us for a long time. It'd be kind of sad to lose him, but we'll always come back. Cool! Onward! To the place where I keep dying. <laughs> He's back. He's back. Ah. Ah. <laughs> All right. We're not going to die this time. Sorry, I keep eating chips every single time these guys are coming in. <laughs> Never expected, man. Neon wall, for sure. All right, Phantom Nightmarian. Oh, not Nightmarian. Sorry, <laughs> Phantom Marion, Marionette. Um, I'm having like a brain fart. Switch. Um, I definitely want to use Mimic. Hurry and let me use Mimic, please. Thank you. This guy is so incredibly useful. Alright, Freddles. Once this neon wall goes down, we're gonna go back. We're gonna go back and use it again. Okay, okay, okay. Um, yeah. We're gonna switch. Oh my. Should I switch because he just jump scared them? Okay. Let's use a neon wall. Quickly. Quickly! Okay. Now we have a shield. I guess Mimic is gonna double that, but that works for me. Phantom Marionette is uh, quite strong. 
new party member. Oh, we get another gold box? Oh, we never even got it in the first place. I think we died right here last time. Auto regeneration? Ooh. All right, um, do all of these ones go somewhere? Um, no, none of them do? Um, what? Get out of here. Oh, a challenger, Golden Freddy, oh my gosh. Okay, let's get to our second party. Our second party is a little bit stronger, I think. Especially with the Mimic. Ah, oh, I'm excited to have Golden Freddy! He's uh, gonna be a little bit strong, a little bit difficult to take down, I imagine. Okay, thank goodness! The Water Hose 2 saved us. Okay. Hmm. We're dealing with a bunch of new characters right now, so... What kind of attacks do we got over here? Let's try using Haunting. Six hundred damage, wow. Chance to turn an enemy into stone. My. It didn't even work! Two times and it didn't work. Well, that sucks. Hmm. What an interesting attack. Alright, let's try that again. It didn't work! Oh my gosh! The chance must be kind of low. Oh? Oh, it worked! Sick. Alright, I guess we're gonna build a nightmare team now because we have three characters. Let's just reset our teams and start from scratch. Let's add the nightmares as our team number one, along with the paper pals because of Mimic Ball. If we can get Mimic started at the very beginning of every battle, we shouldn't have much of an issue. Um, and as for our second team, let's go with Golden Freddy, Plush Trap, um, Endo Plush, no, 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 um, and the Puppets, the Puppets, our Goldens and the Puppets, that's perfect. Oh, this is exciting, oh my gosh, I love Endo too, no, he's so cute, he's adorable. I still need to find my freaking way! One of these tents is supposed to be the way out. Man, it's always when I'm eating chips. I gotta stop eating chips, man. Withered Chica, it's about time. Dang. Oh. Did she literally just die from hot cheese? Well, I mean, I think she's a weaker character. I think. I mean, compare her to these. I mean, I know that further down you go, the stronger they are. Hmm. Withered Chica, bite. Yeah, she doesn't even have bite two, she has bite one. Cupcake prize ball two. I don't think we're gonna use her right now. Oh! Withered Freddy! Oh my gosh, I love Withered Freddy! I can't even see anything. Oh, he died! <laughs> oh no, I love Withered Freddy. I mean, I love our nightmare team, but we're gonna have to do a Withered team. We got him, we got him. Mmm. Let's keep our nightmare team for now, but later we will be doing a Withered team for sure. For sure. Withered Freddy is like one of my most favorite FNAF characters of all time. He's just so cute. A green tent? I've walked towards every tent! Alright, the guide says go into a green tent. Uh, on the map, none of them look green, but that one's green. Can I go in that one?
Well, okay. That's uh. <laughs> so my problem is I went like this. You have to go like this. Dang it. Oh, well, at least we found it. Thank you, um, RPGs.com. Whoa. White rabbits! Oh, we're in the glitchy part of the game. Oh, the white rabbits are so cute. Alright, these guys are probably gonna be really strong, so I need to be careful. At least we got the Mimic out. Yeah, none of them have died so far. They're all still alive. Oh my gosh. None of them have died! Okay, we're on our next team, I guess. Oh, we killed one of them. Holy crap, it's about time. Of course we had to run into four of an enemy right when we enter, right? I don't think haunting is gonna work. It basically never does. Oh my gosh, it actually worked! I spoke too soon. One of the white rabbits is frozen. That's good. Oh, I did not mean to do that twice in a row. Come on, he's almost dead. We can do this. Come on! Come on, he's got to be almost dead by now. Or not. Oh, thank goodness! <laughs> I thought that we were done for. I thought we were absolutely done for. We made it, though. That's good. Sick. Um, I want to change my bites because I don't want to be using the boss guy. He seems kind of useless currently. Let's use the shield instead. Well, I like our little reaper instead. How about that? Virtua Freddy! Now we can actually see him with our mimic. Okay, which tent should I go in? Let's start with this one. Okay. <laughs> the effects that Scott used in this game is so funny. We're gonna hit all the first tents first, that way we don't get too lost. It's Tangle! If only she could be on our team, that'd be so cool. She's so cute! Oh! Ah! Funtime Foxy! Why is her name question marks? No idea. Oh, she died pretty easy. Have their names always been question marks? Oh, I guess maybe they have been. No, I swear she's the only one who had question marks for her name. I might be wrong. Cosmic Song gift- GIFT BOXES! Oh, we definitely want her on our team. I don't know what Cosmic Song is. Probably healing? I don't know. Alright, let's reset our teams again. Alright, you'll have to see my team next time we get into a battle. Which probably is soon. Um, I don't know what I'm doing here, but let's try it. Oh, we just need to get him in the box. Why did the- uh, why did the fourth one have to be so freaking hard to the point where I lost? That just sucks. Anyway, um... 
Whoa, white rabbit, okay. So, our first team, toys. Bash Jam. Ah, oh, it's gonna be so cute. More gift boxes, uh, we didn't need to do that, but you know. And our second team, Withered Animatronics, plus Shadow Freddy. This is gonna be really fun. We're gonna have these for a little bit, I think. Or we're gonna try. Um, this team is a little bit weak right now, so I don't know how well this is gonna go, because some of them are so new. We'll try our best, though. Hopefully we can level up a bit here. Alright, up. Oh boy, this is quite the maze. Oh wait, what? We just went in a circle, huh? Yeah. Well, good to know. I'll take that. Oh. Oh, three tangles. Oh my goodness. This'll be interesting. Cosmic song, what does that do? Ooh, I like. Oh, we need to do gift boxes again. Bring some characters back to life here. Yeah! Dang! That type Foxy's freaking powerful, man. I think we've been here before. Oh, it's getting real mazy, isn't it? Hmm. This seems to have uh, just taken us really into circles. Right now. I don't even know how to get back. Red bear. Cute. Well, let's massacre them. I really like these recolored characters. They're fun. Can you guys imagine, though, a FNAF world where we had all of the FNAF characters. Like, that would be a lot of characters. Which would make it super fun. Oh, Challenger! Nightmare Bonnie! Fantastic! Why did I do that? Why did I do that? All right. Cosmic Song. This attack is so powerful. It's crazy. Poppers. Ooh, escape key worked. Nice. I'm not gonna adjust our teams just yet because we just barely built this one and they're kind of fun for now. We will at some point. Um, you know, once I stop being so lost. Okay, I went ahead and teleported out because, according to this guide, there's a green tent that we can get into. It might be this one. No, it says you can approach it from below, so... Oh, it must be this guy. Okay. There's another green tent we can go into. That's not what's supposed to happen. Deep metal mine. Back here again. Okay. Alright, so these guys should be not that hard to kill, since this is the mine after all. But who knows, who knows. Should be pretty easy to stack, we've dealt with them a long time ago. Our team is a little weak though, uh, it didn't seem to matter. Okay, let's go north. What are we gonna find in here? A glitched item, maybe? Oh, more rot.
Oh my gosh, it's mad and oh my gosh. Okay, uh I'm like freezing up here like a deer in headlights. Uh was not expecting that. Let's get our gift boxes back. Okay. Ah! Oh my gosh, we need gift boxes again. Uh. Gift boxes, please, thank you. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're doing some pretty good damage. Nice. I almost clicked mystery box. I would not be happy if I did that. Not right now. Gift boxes. Yes. Okay. This is actually not so bad. But Funtime Foxy, she is absolutely wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> it's hard to die when we've got her. Prize ball two. Ooh. Okay, he is done for. We've definitely gotten better at defeating Mad Endos, so there's that. He is a cheapskate though, he gives us no money. Whatever. And what do we get? Curse status. Enemies begin battle with all status ailments. Ooh! That's beautiful, I like that. Let's do regeneration. Let's do curse status, that's cool. Let's keep find characters on and... Eh, let's do some good old defense. Cool. That just seems like a really good item. And I think that's all there's to see here. Everything else was a dead end. So, back we go. So let's keep checking for green tents, huh? That's it. I think we're supposed to go in this green tent, but I got so lost last time. Okay, good news. I know what to do. Apparently there is a tombstone that we can touch in order to get out of here. I don't know how to get to that tombstone, but at least we know that it is not an endless trap. Oh, very nice. I enjoy that. I was a little bit trapped for a little bit there. I hate to admit it. Oh boy, here we go. What? Are we back here? Okay, uh, yeah, we don't want to, oh boy. Challenger! <gasps> Crying child, oh my gosh. Well, immediately I'm gonna use gift boxes on you. <laughs> oh, that is so funny. It's so weird how he's a character in this game. Well, not really, because this game is just weird in general, but you know. And the freaking Grim Reaper is what killed him. Yikes. Well, would you look at that? Power song, armor song, gift boxes. Hey, that's a good character to have. We're not switching teams just yet, though. We're gonna collect a few more characters before we do that. Yay, there's a boss battle. Let's do it. Baba! Oh my gosh, I forgot what kind of goofy names these characters have sometimes. I mean, Baba's kind of cute. It is adorable. He, uh, he looks like he's related to Dreadbear. And he's got the little gear in his back. That's really cute. <laughs> Why do I have no attacks? Thank you. All right, prize ball. Give me something good. Cupcakes, not bad. Prize ball two, give me something better. Oh. This guy doesn't do very much damage, but his health is mad. Oh wow, a single munchie. 
Oh, we need to use. No, not yet. His health, though. Holy crap. He's not doing much in terms of damage. Although, jump scare is kind of a pain in the butt. I hope we can get another gift box off before Funtime Foxy dies. Yes, perfect. Another jump scare. Holy crap, I swear his health bar doesn't even go down. Bubba, you are... No way an unscrew 2 just murdered him. I basically never see the unscrews work against bosses. Impressive. And that came from a prize box too? Wow. Super impressive. Nice. Oh no. I have a feeling this is gonna be real mazy again. I'll attempt it. Hopefully I can figure it out by my- Oh. Oh! Well, I did figure it out, I think. No, I did not. I'm pretty sure I've been here before. <gasps> Endo 01! Yay! A new character! Dang it. I was hoping we could murder him right away. That'd been nice. He might be really weak, so this might not be a problem at all. Okay, that took a little bit, but it's not like he did much damage to us. Cool. Endo 2 now? Oh my gosh, we're gonna have an endo team. Maybe it's about time we change teams again. Maybe. I don't know, it's like we don't have our teams for very long. I'm sorry if I'm getting a little bit quiet. I'm getting pretty tired. I think I'm gonna be taking a break pretty soon. This is such a long game, I can't expect to play it all in one sitting. I'm actually pretty exhausted. And we got him! Oh, okay, so according to this guide, there's a bit of a secret. If we go into this tent, walk through the left wall. Ah, okay. So apparently this is gonna take us to an item. Which will be good. I would like to collect basically all the game items within this gameplay, so let's not miss anything. Any day now, White Rabbit. Any day. There we go. Ooh! Counter Bite. What is that? Enemy attacks are countered with a damaging bite. I like that. I like the curse status too. Auto regeneration is nice. And find characters. Okay, cool, cool. Okay, so according to the guide, these are all just gonna lead us into loops, so we have to just go right through this wall. <laughs> they want the red bear. Hello. Right? Or maybe it's this one. Yeah, there we go. Ooh. And this is where we're gonna stop for now. I will be back on a later date. And here we are, back on hard mode. We've put, did that say four hours? We put four hours into this. No, we're not gonna click new game. And you know what is so funny? I was like, oh no, uh, the clocks. I, I'm doing them wrong. Well, as I was editing some of this footage, I'm like, oh my gosh. I did the clock right by accident. So that means I've been doing all the clocks right by accident, but when I was editing, I didn't see a fourth clock. I think I've skipped the fourth clock, so even though I did do them correctly, I don't think we're getting the ending anyways. So there's that. And our team is just a mess. Let's go ahead and just start fresh, since it's a brand new day, and I plan on beating this game today. Not only beating it, but beating multiple endings today. Like, we are going to kick some butt. I think that team number one should be an endo crying child team. <laughs> Metal skeletons and ghost child team. And team number two can be... 
let's do something really weird. Let's go with the classics. Um, their attacks are trash, but it should be fun to play with them again. They're all kind of around level 8, whereas our newer characters that we've been playing are more like 20s. So, you know, that'll go well. Nightmare Fredbear! Oh, and we're talking to good old Fredbear here. Um, not Nightmare version. Um, okay, I don't want chips. I don't want bites. I don't want none of that stuff. I want it all taken off because it just makes this game a little too easy right now. You found the exit! That's amazing. The giant pig lies on the other side of this subtunnel. He guards a key that opens the locks to the final guardians. Each guardian protects a button. Once you have found and pressed the buttons, the gates protecting the game's security system will be lowered. Ooh, that's when you can strike at the heart of whatever is corrupting this world. Navigate your way through the subtunnels, but remember, don't go more than three glitches down. Good luck! Oh, this is our opportunity to go more than three glitches down. Maybe we should take it. Attacking the game's security system will not accomplish anything. Eh, yeah. Get the key, but ignore the guardians. If you have succeeded in setting the clocks, then your true goal will be revealed once you have the key. So we have to find a key and not go against the bosses. I'm not even sure this is going to work, because I think it's very possible we skipped a clock. But... We shall try. Oh, that's an entry point, I think? I think the dots mean entry points. Alright. Oh. We're gonna take the first path first. That way I can try and remember. Um, because I have a feeling this is gonna take multiple attempts to walk through. Okay, only one way that time. Uh. Clearly I'm- oh, it's right there. Sometimes it's hard to see on the big screen. I mean, I'm using these massive monitors. This game, I think, gets so stretched out on big monitors. Hmm. Oh! Okay, okay, okay. We went in a circle. But I didn't see any branching paths. Yes, I did. It's right there. Okay, so this is clearly the way. We have to go right. Um, that... Uh... We just went in a circle. We're going in circles, guys! Okay, there must be something I'm missing. Ha! Okay. So I had to walk through that tree. Uh, <laughs> dang it. I should have been able to figure that one out by myself. I mean, the glitch object was just on the other side of it. I don't know. I guess I wasn't thinking hard enough. Well, here we are. Um, three layers down. About to enter the fourth layer pretty soon. I'm just gonna go for it because I, I can't remember if it ruins your save or not. But if it ruins my save, oh well. You know, it is what it is. I wanna get all the endings anyways, so let's just go ahead and jump into the first ending we see. I think I messed up the clocks anyways. So once we find it, we shall go down into it. Currently, I'm not seeing. Any glitched objects in here? Maybe it's further. Yep, I guess it's further. Further in. Okay. I am going to attempt to walk through trees if they look tempting. Hmm. I guess I move on. Okay. Nothing here. Oh, we can get out. Alright, I guess we're getting out for now. 
Where are we going to appear? Pork patch! Oh, and the key! So if the key's there, does that mean I actually did the clocks right? I don't know, all I know is that pork patch is probably gonna be really hard. Uh... That was weird. <laughs> Okay, um, we've never used Crying Child before. Power Song raises attack power. Okay, and Speed Song. Uh, we haven't used hardly any of these characters before. His whole top half just, um, came off. That was weird. And, uh, yeah, these guys are really underleveled, so... Yeah. Endo Army. I don't even remember that! Why does this top half come off? <laughs> Alright, this is probably gonna end horribly, but let's try it. Let's just jump right into this. Alright, immediately I'm gonna start protecting myself. Uh, gift box... Alright, I think I have leveled up just enough to beat this guy already. Oh! <laughs> okay. I, I swear I ran into him, but I guess I wasn't close enough. Come on, seaweed. Let's get this over with already, man. Alright, give me someone who can attack. Now, I've realized that my secondary team's really terrible. It doesn't even matter that these guys are leveling up, their attacks are just that bad. Especially Bonnie, his attacks are really bad. But, we'll see what happens, right? I'm glad these guys are my first team because they do a lot of really important, like, startup things. Um... Such as buffing everybody up, putting up a shield, getting out the gift boxes, all those things very, very important. Oh, and I I guess I forgot to get out my endo army, which I really should have done, because he's not losing any damage. He's not losing any health yet. Did I... Did I just seriously avoid using it again? Okay, can we use it now? <laughs> that was a little late, but that's alright. Now we really need a neon wall again. There we go. Okay. Now we're, we're back on track. We're totally buffed up. We got our wall, we got our endos. So let's switch for a little bit and do some minor damage with this team. Oh, Happy Gem is pretty useless right now because we're already totally buffed up. But, you know, whatever. Low damage plus healing, sure, I guess. <laughs> 16 damage! Alright, switching back to our main team. Let's get everyone back to uh, where we need to be, including the gift boxes. Please, before we die. Wow! Okay. <laughs> we definitely don't want to lose the crying child. He is very, very important piece to this. Alright, we need to buff everybody up again. There we go. Um, we really, really need to use gift boxes again. No, I meant to click Endo Army! Oh, that's okay, that's okay. At least we got our gift boxes. Can we have an Endo Army back, please? Thank you. These guys are awesome. They do all the attacks here. Alright, switch back to our other team for a little bit. This guy's almost done for. He's really close. Alright! Yay! That did it! That wasn't so bad. We just needed to level up just a little bit, and I really gotta work with this secondary team because, whoo boy, are they bad! But if they got all the buffs and everything, then they're a lot better. So we have a key now. So... The question is... Did we do it right? I know that there's a locked spot up here. Alright, we could really just run from these guys. There's a locked spot right up here. What does it do? It makes the boss come out. Not really, but you know. Oh my gosh! 
He murdered our gift boxes. We need. Oh my gosh, why is he so strong? Oh, we are gonna die. There's absolutely no doubt. Why is he so strong? I, I, I've gone against this guy before. He wasn't this bad. Okay. Okay, let's uh, unlock this again. Oh, he's. It's scripted, that's why. Oh my gosh. I should have known. Okay, wait a minute. I think every time I open one of those keys, there's gonna be a boss. So, let's start with the key in this area because surely that's gonna be the easiest boss to defeat. Surely. It's gonna be a wood chipper and I bet it's gonna be a lot easier to beat than Seagoon. I think I'm probably supposed to do it in order and I didn't think about that. All right. Yes? No? No boss? Um... Maybe it's the key up there? <laughs> what did this do? Well, that's weird. Um, wait! Run luck? Is that what that said? Running away is more successful. Okay, that's the only one I actually- well, and the fine characters. Those are the only ones I want because they don't affect battle, they just affect gameplay. <laughs> That was unrelated to unlocking things, so... Back at it! I knew it! I knew the seagull was important, I just didn't remember why. Uh... I forgot about this. Um, I don't know how strong these- they're very strong. So there's that. <laughs> Come on guys, let's attack already. Thank you. Whew. Um, let's see, are they even close to death yet? No. That doesn't look good. <gasps> no! Oh. We lost the crying child. That could be bad. Come on, let's get our endo army back, please. Oh boy. I think we're gonna die. <laughs> How much damage did that just do? It looked like a lot. Okay, um, I don't know if we're supposed to get into the glitched part yet. Maybe we should save that for later. Snow cone! At least we got to use gift boxes first, that's nice. Wow, we are barely- we are not even hardly denting this guy. So there's that. Endo army? I mean, we're getting somewhere, it's just very slow. Um, I wonder if we're gonna be able to keep this up. <laughs> Okay, we got fully buffed up. Let's see if we can do some damage now. Bonnie's attack is so pathetic. That's the sad part. We need our endo army back. And we need our gift boxes too! Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, we just lost our gift box to Crying Child! 
That's very bad. That's very, very bad. Oh! We lost our gift boxes. Okay. Come on! You got this. Endo army, please. This is bad. Oh no, this is terrible! Don't kill him, 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 don't kill him! And don't worry! <laughs> oh! Come on! You can do it! <laughs> so close. So close. Alright, he's almost dead. Come on, you guys can do this. Come on, Bonnie! Literally just one of the Endo's attacks is stronger than Bonnie's whole attack. That's pretty pathetic. Alright, we're almost there, we're almost there, we're almost there. <sighs> we're good, we're good. As long as we got the gift boxes, then we're good. He's almost dead! Fight, Bonnie, come on! Alright, one more attack is all he really needs. <laughs> Bonnie's bite couldn't even do it. Water hose too, he's got a dot of health. Water hose doesn't work on, on bosses, apparently. Alright, it should be over. It should be over. Okay. <laughs> That was a bit of a struggle, but we did it! I like our Endo army. They're fantastic. And? What did it do? I have no idea! Alright guys, I think it's time for us to beat Seagoon now, because I think we're ready. We went ahead and defeated Snowball, or whatever the heck that guy's name was. I think we're ready for Seagoon at this point. All right, we, oh, but he hits so, oh my gosh, we. I'm so lost, I'm so confused. How is this even possible, bro? How? All right, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go into this glitched area mess around, have some fun, and level up, because apparently we need to be a higher level to defeat Seagoon, there's no doubt about that. Um, if we can walk through anything, there's a chest over here. Oh, it doesn't- we don't really know what we can walk through, that's the thing. That'll be interesting. We could definitely live if we don't run into too many of these at once. I'm pretty sure we can live. Oh, I just used the same one twice, so that's cool. There we go. But those attacks uh, are something else. <laughs> um, shoot. None of them have died yet. Oh, one of them has died! They both died! Sweet! What? Some of those attacks do 9,999? What the heck? Wait, did nobody level up? I think... I don't know. 
There's only certain places I can go here, so let's find my limits. Clearly I can't go left. And I can't go further down. Okay. Oh, it's a glitchy prototype! Okay. I like it. He is destroying us. <laughs> Oh boy, okay. We really need our gift boxes back. Thank you! <laughs> this is too funny. This is always one of my favorite parts of the, of the game. Just because it's so weird and comes out of the- out of nowhere. You're just like- You think you're nearing the end of the game and then this happens and you're like, There's more? That's the cool thing about FNAF World. It seems like- it's just very large. There's so much to do. Yes! Yes! Super- Yes! Spring trap! Oh my gosh, yes! Okay, let's try not to die. Uh, it's been a while since I've seen a new character. And, of course, I'm excited to see this character. Yay! He's gonna be on our team for sure. Alright. Let's get some damage in here. I'm so excited! He's not murdering us, so that's nice. Yeah, he's really not. I guess we c Oh! We killed him! Okay! This team! We are putting Springtrap on this team. Because I don't want to mess with our first team. Our first team's pretty sick. Um, let's just... Let's throw him as our first on our team too. Yay! I love Springtrap! My favorite FNAF character of all time. Okay, uh... Let's just have a, a team revolving around Springtrap, which means we obviously need a little plush trap on it. Let's go ahead and throw Golden Freddy on there too, and Paper Pals, because they're freaking weird. Okay, I'm pretty sure we're gonna have a way better chance against Seagoon now that we have Springtrap on our team, <laughs> I would think. Oh, glitchy ball boys. Okay. All right, I really want to switch uh, teams right now and try them out. Is this? Who is this? Who's? Oh, that's plus trap. Toxic bite. Okay. Spring locks. Maximum area damage. Awesome. Okay, this is Golden Freddy jump scare. And mimic ball. Oh my gosh, this team is actually going to be really sick. The attacks that they have over here are gonna be incredible. Rainy day. Spring locks. Bite too. Ooh, so a really good bite attack. Awesome! Oh. Oh, what? Can we go to Pig Patch? I don't want to. <laughs> All right, there should be a gift box. Oh, nope. All right, one second, let me deal with these guys. <laughs> I'm like, please don't have me run into Seagoon right now. That would not be appreciated. Can I pick this up? I can! Auto shield. Um, that's really neat, but I'm not using chips right now. That's the only chest I've picked up so far. I hope I didn't miss any. Alright, we've done a lot of leveling up. I think we're ready to attempt this once again. Let's get those gift boxes on immediately. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's 
get the mimic ball on, please? Mimic ball, please? Yes. Okay, now switch and get those gift boxes on again. Please, 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 please. Gift boxes, please! Ah! Gift boxes, please! <laughs> oh my gosh. That did nothing because they all died. Oh, the mimic ball helped us a little bit, but not enough. Oh my gosh. Gift boxes, oh my gosh, yes. Switch. Switch teams, let's do some damage. Come on, let's get some damage in here. Yes. Okay, bad pizza. Oh my gosh, we just- oh. Okay, gift boxes, please. Gift boxes! Gift boxes! Ah! Oh my gosh! Oh, thank you for the mimic ball! Can we please do some damage now? Oh no! Oh my gosh! Oh, we were doing so good. Not good enough. Look at what I found, you guys. Uh, there's a portal behind this lock. But I actually came here originally because I think that there's a glitched object that can put us on the overworld again here. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's inside the mine. Oh, that was weird. <laughs> Let's get this gold chest. I don't think there is. Maybe there's not. I want to check the mine in a second. Well, let's check the mine first, and then we'll go back to this portal. Um, does it look familiar, though? Glitched object inside here. I know that there's a glitched object in one of the mines, because then you can walk around and you can pick up that one treasure chest that's, like, hovering. I would... Guess it's not this one though. Mm. Let's go check out that portal. Weirdly, it's like a whirlpool portal, but it's in the grass. Is there a boss? We are still your friends. Do you believe that? The pieces are in place for you. Did I do it? Did I do it? All you have to do is find them. Rest. The end. No way, did I did I do the clock ending? I thought I messed it up so many different times. Fascinating. So this game fleshes out FNAF 3. Interestingly enough. Because obviously the clocks are highly, heavily related to the FNAF 3 odd things you have to do in order to get the good ending. So it's almost like as you play through this game, you're maybe a soul trapped inside of a video game? So let's say, if I was right about FNAF 3, the puppet is the one that's saving the children, not the night guard, it's the puppet. Because the puppet is there in FNAF 3, standing in the hallway, not a phantom, but like an actual puppet. And then, when you're giving the cake to the children at the very, very last minigame, the very important minigame that ties all the minigames together, you're a kid with a puppet mask. So does that mean in FNAF world, the puppet is gathering the pieces throughout this video game somehow? Gathering the tools to help the children move on? Nothing! No trophy? Oh! The trophies are on this screen, duh! We got the crime trial trophy. I think that's the clock ending, you guys. I think we did it. I have no idea how I did it, but I did it somehow. <laughs> Yay! 
Now we have to get like six more endings, because this is a big game. <laughs> no way! That's so sick. You guys have to look at my water bottle. Look at this sticker that I got. Ah! That wasn't very superstar of you. <laughs> Puppet pizza. Let's kill the night guard. <laughs> yeah, and this one's kind of cute too. I love stickers. All right. Um. Seagoon. <laughs> Gosh. The amount of times that I've tried to beat Seagoon. Attempt number five million. Of course you kill the gift boxes first! Why did I even try? Why? 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 No, there was no point in trying that. There was no point in trying that! We're doing something else now. Let's enter this area and try to find a glitched object. Is there... Like... I know there's a tree or something that you can walk through. I, I didn't find anything last time for some reason. Like, I don't- I'm so confused. And we're just dealing with a bunch of graveweed who are very kind of weak, but still annoying. I'm pretty sure when we first went through this area, I like tried to go through many of things, but I couldn't. But maybe it's because I didn't realize before that when you try to go through an object in this game, you basically have to keep walking into it like aggressively like this. Or else it does nothing. So... Yeah. I'm gonna go explore and wish me luck. Hopefully I find something. Oh yeah, heck yeah. Let's see what we can find. Oh. I wanted it. <laughs> oh well. Sometimes a single box bite glitch thing and you're just wondering, how much freaking life does this guy have? Two million? <laughs> I mean, he like wiped out most of my team there. That's kind of embarrassing for me. Whoa. Okay, we're way all the way out here. Oh no! Wish me luck! Hopefully, I don't die. I survived! Barely. Oh, I wonder if this is when I can get that hovering chest. Probably. All right. Um, I guess if I check the map, I'll be able to figure it out. But man, there are so many enemies. Ah. Ah. Uh, no. Yeah. No, that's not part of this. Here we go. Auto mimic. Oh my gosh, that is fancy, man. But we're not using that. It is fancy and amazing, but we're not using it. Uh, nope, can't get that. How do I even get there? I don't know. Obviously can't <laughs> reach the boss. Oh, there's a lock in the mine though. We need to go do that. You know, once we can beat Seagoon. That's a whole other thing. Yes! Yes, yes, yes! Finally! Oh my gosh! It's about time. It takes forever to find new characters nowadays. Alright. Let's power up. We're dealing with Shadow Bonnie! Ah! We are putting him on our team, which means we definitely need to level him up for him to be useful at all. Most of our team is level, like, 22, and he's gonna be level 1, so it's gonna take a little bit. Ah! Easy kill, though. 
Yay! Who are we moving? Probably team two. Um, who's our most useless person on our team two? We have to keep Paper Pals because Mimic Ball is freaking amazing. Golden Freddy is not extremely useful on this team, I will admit. I usually just use him for jump scare and sometimes that doesn't even work against bosses, so yeah, we're switching him out. What do we got here, RXQ? Your fantastic name. Haunting? Yeah. Mimic Ball? Oh! You have Mimic Ball! Well, shoot, maybe we get rid of Paper Pals then. You even have gift boxes. That's amazing. That that might be super useful against Seagoon. Let's take a break from grinding and finding characters real quick and talk to Fredbear because he's been standing here and these little uh, barriers have been disappearing. I wonder why. Uh, it's pretty obvious. There used to be four of them and we've defeated two of the end game bosses, I guess you would call them. The ones hidden behind keys. So I'm assuming once we defeat Seagoon and Overclock, those will be down. And then we could take care of one of the final bosses. So let's talk to him because he's been waiting around here for a little while. This is it! This is the path to the game's security system. If you have found all the buttons, then your path should be clear. Yeah, not yet. <laughs> That's what the buttons are! Okay, it's not the bosses. The bosses are protecting the buttons, but it's the buttons. The security system has powerful defenses. Make sure you have someone with a shield ability. You won't survive without it. Uh, yeah, you're right about that. I carry around a shield with me at all times. Um, I will tell you a secret. Okay. There are powerful chips that can only be attained by breaking the game. The red chests. Ah. There are objects that you can press against, and it will break your collision detection. One is a yellow bird on a tree stump. Another is a gravestone. We already got those. We already found them. Thank you! Find these places to gain an unfair advantage. That is, if you insist on following this path that has been forcefully placed before you, something terrible is coming. <laughs> Doesn't that usually foreshadow baby? In this case, is it foreshadowing Scott? I don't know. Boop, 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 boop. Can't go through that. Well, that was fun. We still need to beat those mini bosses. Yes, another challenger. Oh my gosh. Nightmare for Red Bear. Yes. Yes, I've been wanting to add this guy to my team. Awesome! He should be pretty easy, I think, because my team is pretty strong right now. Is he down that far? Yes. Yes. My team is very strong, plus I have all the added stuff on right now. Nightmare Fredbear! Yes! Alright, our second team is getting a bit of a new character. A bit of a new character. <laughs> like, that makes any sense. Um, Golden Freddy, mostly... Uh, the most useless one on this team. I love you, Golden Freddy. However, we're upgrading you. <laughs> uh, Toxic Bite 2, not bad. Freddles, not bad. Megabyte, I'm sure that's gonna be great. That's what we're gonna probably use the most. Sweet. So, our second team is still just the damaging team. They do so much damage. It's crazy. <laughs> and he's level 1, so, um... That means we still need to level up a lot. I wonder if there's any more characters we can get right now just by walking around. Let's see. We could probably get... I would imagine we can get all the way up to Scott. So we could probably get five more characters. Unless we can only get Nightmare. And then we have to make sure we beat the game before we can get the rest of these. Because I know that the... Very bottom page is like a lot of update 2 stuff slash mini bosses. I'm gonna gain some experience defeating this bad boy, Bubba. But I want to check out Nightmare Fredbear 
and his attacks. Ah, oh, he's so cute! Brettles, we should have used Megabyte, but that's okay. Ah, uh, Spring Locks. And let's use Shadow Bonnie, too. He, he obviously has a lot of good stuff. Um, I already have the Mimic Ball out right now. I probably should have used gift boxes, honestly. Oh well. Kind of a big mistake, but I don't know if it matters right now. Oh, we got to use him again. That was weird. Did we skip Flesh Drop? Mega Bite! Maximum Damage Bite. It didn't seem like it did that much. Oh yeah, he's like level 4 right now, so what am I? What do I expect? <laughs> Oh, I love him. He's huge, though. Look at how huge he is. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna finish up, Bubba. I'll see you next time something interesting happens. Alright, guys. I watched a little video that showed me the secret. I would have never figured that one out. <laughs> uh, wow, Totemol. How scary. But it leads to a chest! So let's go get it! Uh, I keep seeing this chest when I'm in the overworld, I guess you could call it. And I'm always like, how the freak do I get it? Oh, there's a boss! Oh, he's an easy boss. I'm assuming by the fact that his health is going down very, very quickly. So I probably should have gotten this a lot earlier, but whatever. <laughs> I, uh, I don't know this game up and down, sadly. I will after this, though. I'm putting hours into this game. <laughs> hours. Yeah, only 600 experience? That's not a whole lot. Yeah, at least we leveled up a little bit. What did we get? Pizza Fury. What? A steady stream of pizzas keep rolling in. <laughs> okay. Uh, alright, I guess we'll use that while I'm grinding, because it sounds funny. Alright guys, as you can see, I'm very clearly missing a chip here, an orange chip, or a gold chip. Totally missed it. Um, and it seems like they kind of come in order. You get all the green ones, the gold ones, the red ones. Um, so I looked up a little guide, and apparently it's in this mysterious cave here. And I looked at the map, I was really studying the map really hard, and I'm like, I don't understand how to get to this chest. And then finally it dawned on me. It was very obvious. At least I think it's very obvious. I was like, okay, so up at the very top there, there's an ice ore and you can get a chip. I already got that one. But this other one on the other side of the cave, I couldn't figure out how to get to. And then I realized you gotta go where I'm at down and around. I think there, there's like a sagebrush there, but I think you just walk through it. Or a tumbleweed. I think? Because I tried reading this guide and I don't understand what it's trying to tell me, so I think it's this? Yeah, I think it's this! There should be a boss guarding the chip as well, but it should be easy because I think we were supposed to have done it a long time ago. But I'm sitting here grinding, trying to collect characters anyway. It's like, I might as well collect all the items that I'm missing. Should be right up here, right? Yeah! I can't believe I never got that before. It's so odd. Oh my gosh, he's massacred! I didn't even attack him. I literally just got gift boxes and that's it. <sighs> Finally! And this is Ever Comet Strong. Which is really nice. I don't know if we'll be switching anything right now. We're using really good stuff at the moment. Now we need to find whatever these two red chips are. So I'm gonna find a guide. Freddle Fury. Okay, so that's what we're looking for next. There's a false wall along the bottom edge of the passageway from Lily Gear Lake to Black Tomb Yard. Ooh. Okay. We might be able to just use that one hint to get there. I like hints. I don't need entire guides. Run! I mean, I am grinding, that's for sure, but these guys are not even worth it. Whatever. I guess they are worth it. 480 experience. Yeah, I didn't think I'd get a level from that. Alright, Lily Gear Lake. So if we're headed down this direction... 
in the passageway. I wonder if it's obvious or if it's just totally random. Okay. Well. Maybe this one? No, too obvious. Probably one of these, I would imagine. Yeah! All right. Uh, but still I... Oh! Okay. Got a little bit of a grave weed problem here. So glad we found this finally. Hmm. Am I gonna have to go through another wall? Look at all the damage counters. It's absolutely nuts. <laughs> With those pizzas, oh my gosh. I wonder what's stronger, the frettles or the pizzas? <laughs> Maybe it's equal and it's up to aesthetic choice. Oh, hello, I found that immediately. Grave? Stone? Ah, oh, come on! No, we got a level! Oh! Hello! This is quite the maze, isn't it? Mad Endo! How hard is it gonna be? Um, a little difficult, but not bad. Especially with all of our added stuff right now. Shouldn't be a problem. Actually, um, for our last red chip, I'm gonna go ahead and not use any of the chips and bites. Just so we can kind of see where our team is at realistically. I don't know why I decided to play this game on hard mode and then also make it harder on myself even more by not using the chips and bites. I just kind of want to do that. Lots of experience! Nice! And... Freddle Fury. Okay. Freddle's constantly attack. Pizza Fury. Hmm. Well, sure, let's use it for a little while, I guess. I imagine they're probably equal when it comes to the damage. There's only one chip we have left, actually. So let's go grab that, and then we'll attempt Seagoon. <laughs> oh, in dusting fields, um, the northernmost rock. Oh, it disables collision, okay. Oh, I really thought that there wasn't one here, but I guess there is. Let's go do it. Can I afford your last item now? I can, thank you. Spent all my money, but look at that, we're collecting the bites. Cool! Hello, Freddy! Oh, he, um, is attacking us. Not really, but... There's the Freddles! The damage counter! I'm always shocked by that. It's absolutely nuts. Over here, maybe? Oh, it's this red chest! Oh, okay, I was wondering about that one. I was trying to get to that one earlier, and I was like, why can't I get to it? Awesome! We're about to get all the chips! Where is it? There it is! Block unscrew. Now that sounds insane. Unscrew and escape key are blocked. Oh! Oh. Okay, never mind. I thought it was gonna work differently than that. I thought it was more like the counter, not block. But... Uh, characters can't use that against you anymore. That's interesting. 
that'd be nice against Seagoon, except for the problem is he doesn't use unscrew very often. He uses it on occasion, but it's his regular attack that just kills me anyway, so it doesn't really seem to matter. All right, chips are complete. Um, I'm really low on money currently, so we're not going to be able to finish out the bites just yet. Um, there's not a whole lot left, but some of them are really, really expensive, so that's going to take more grinding money-wise. Alright guys, we're giving it another attempt, which means taking off the chips. Uh, I'm just leaving those on because those don't affect battle. And taking off the bites. Uh, I can't believe I'm doing this. I could easily win him if I had all that stuff, but for some reason, deep down, I don't want to use it. So let's give it another go! Our team is very leveled up, so hopefully it makes a difference. Gift boxes? Okay, we got gift boxes. Um, I don't really want to use I-beam right now. Okay, things are doing better than before. There's no doubt about that. We need to get our Mimic in here, though. Mimic Ball, thank you. We also really need gift boxes again. Oh my gosh. Um, this might just be bad luck, but gift boxes? Come on! Oh, he appeared for half a second! Okay, that might have just been really bad RNG. Let's try it again. Look, you guys! I'm about to beat him! Except for the fact that... That was not the sea goon that I actually needed to beat. False alarm! <laughs> Gift boxes as our first one! I like that. And then we lost him immediately. Oh my gosh. I don't know though. We might have something here. Maybe. It'd be great if we can get gift boxes again. Gift boxes, please! 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 Ah! Whew. Okay. We have a chance here. We have a chance here. Give ah! Oh. Oh. Gift boxes! Gift boxes! Gift boxes! Ah! Oh, that was definitely the furthest I've ever been. Oh, I'm done. I've tried. I've really, really, really tried. Look at the levels on my team. Uh, obviously, Nightmare Fredbear is the lowest, 22. But then you got 30, 25, 28, 32, 30, and 30. I've tried. I've tried. Super Goon will not go down. The most I've ever seen, and I've tried many a times, was like a little more than half of his health. And that was if I got really lucky. If I had the best RNG. If I had the worst RNG, um, sometimes I would take out none of his health before I died. So we're adding chips into this, and hopefully we could do it with just the chips and not the bites. I think we can though. It should make a huge difference. I don't care about unscrew. We definitely need the pizza, we need to get as much damage going on as we possibly can. We also want to start with gift boxes, for sure. Um, what else do we want? We definitely want the mimic already there. If the mimic and the gift boxes are already there, that will help massively. And we probably also want, I would say, endless defense. Well, hmm. No, a shield is probably better, I'm guessing, because it is a red chip. I'm assuming that's more powerful than an orange one. Okay, I'm satisfied with this. 
we should have an actual chance this time. Starting with gift boxes is going to be very different, and with a mimic means we can jump straight into attacks without having to stress. Let's see how this is gonna go. Obviously, I'm still gonna have to spawn in gift boxes from time to time. Obviously. Okay, we really need gift boxes again. We didn't lose him. That's good. Okay, we did lose him. So let's go to Shadow Bonnie and try and get some gift boxes on. Yes! Perfect! Yeah, this is <laughs> going a lot better. Obviously still pretty hard, but nothing compared to what it was before. Gift boxes again, please? Thank you. Should we switch teams? No! Yeah, let's do it. We want the Endo army back out. Oh, we need to s Well, I guess it doesn't matter. We have to switch. Gift boxes? Oh, we just lost our gift boxes. Okay. Oh, this is getting bad now. Come on, we just need to get out a little bit more damage. Come on, spring trap. Our first attempt, we barely lived. Okay, it's decided. We're gonna use chips. <sighs> we got to. Super Goon was absolutely nuts without them. Absolutely nuts. And we're moving on. Finally. Now we just need to go get Overclock, who is in this mine up ahead. Wow, it feels so good to say that Super Goon is dead because that was a weight on my chest, man. We still can't afford that, that is very expensive. <laughs> Not that we'd be using it. All right, where is he now? Um, up top, top right, I believe. And these- oh yeah, starting out with a shield already. I love it. The chips are <laughs> so very appreciated. Overclock, I- he seemed like he was doing basically the same damage as Super Goon, so I don't imagine it's gonna be too scary. But we definitely want to be careful with what we're doing. Power up! Okay, we probably should use gift boxes again soon. Um, it's taking him longer to die, that's for sure. But we're not getting massacred. I mean, not entirely. We definitely need gift boxes, though. Thank you. His health is massive, though. Crazy massive. I just used Speed Song when we didn't need it, but that's okay. Mistakes happen. Oh, uh, wait, this shouldn't- this really shouldn't be a problem, I don't think. He's going down steadily. We got our Mimic, we got our gift boxes. I think we're golden. That's our four bosses! Now we're going up against the end of the game boss for our second ending. Um, security owl. Boop! Save. And... Oh, excuse me, one second. Alright guys, it's time. It's time to attempt the boss for the first time. Um, I have a new team, you guys are gonna have to see it during battle. I turned off the bites, and I turned on the chips. So, let's see what happens. 
Okay. So, this is our Bonnie team, as you can see. Very fun. And our other team is the Nightmares. Wow, his health is going down very slowly. But we have a, a lot is gonna be flying around the screen right now because we got the Mimic, we got everything. We definitely need to hit some gift boxes though, so let's switch back to the first team. We only have one character that can actually do it and that's Shadow Bonnie. So, we gotta make sure he does not die. Please don't kill him, please don't, please don't, no, 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 oh, it really tried, it really tried to kill him. Gift boxes, please, thank you. Oh no, don't kill him, don't kill him, don't. Whew. Once again, he survived. We don't actually need gift boxes just yet, so let's switch teams and get some more damage going. This is some very slow damage. To be expected. It almost feels like we're doing nothing to him! Okay, we should probably get some more gift boxes on. Whew. Please don't kill Shadow Bonnie, please. He does not have a box right now. We're bound to lose Shadow Bonnie at some point, but I really hope it's not soon. This is a very, very slow game here. But it seems to be going well. He doesn't- he's not massacring us, so I enjoy that. I just don't want him to use alarm, because that's when things get really, really sketchy. And I'm not sure if Mimic and the shield end up disappearing, because I know it's automatic. But normally if you use them as an attack, they disappear after a while. Doesn't seem like they're going anywhere, just yet. I'm not going to be using Unscrew, because I don't think that that affects bosses, really. I'm not sure if Megabyte does more damage than the Frettles. I wish I could tell. It'd be nice to have a something to debuff him with, but I don't know if I have anything like... Oh, that's a sketchy attack. I don't think I have anything like that. Well, I guess I have Rainy Day. Maybe I should use that. Rainy Day 2 is what I should use. It hurts him a little bit, and it lowers his defense, which is good. Oh no, switch. I don't want him hitting my Shadow Bonnie. Okay, let's go back. Oh! Uh Oh, that wasn't bad. That wasn't bad at all. Bite 2. I think Freddles does more damage than Bite 2. <gasps> no, 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 no! Don't hit Shadow Bonnie, don't sh Ooh, we're good. Gift boxes, thank you! We're about halfway. And luckily the alarm... It doesn't hit very often. Although there has been a time where I was grinding, where I got hit by like almost every single one of them, which was insane. Because they do like 9,999. Um, yeah, that's a lot of power from one attack. I mean, it basically murders anything that it hits, if it hits. Can I switch out? Yes. We might need gift boxes again soon, though, since we've lost some characters. Oh, yeah, let's use the gift boxes now. If we can get to it. In time. Yep. Oh, Shadow Bonnie doesn't even have one. That's... I don't like that. Shadow Bonnie, let's get you a gift box, please. Thank you. This really is going well, surprisingly. Surprisingly very well. 
Even though a few of my team members are like only level 16, level 17, pretty low. Goes to show you don't need the bites to beat this game. Although you probably need the chips, <laughs> that is for sure. Okay, we need our gift boxes again. Please? Oh! Gift boxes, please! Thank you! <laughs> Ooh, he is so close to being dead. It's about to be over. We're about to get our second ending! Well, at least I think so. Unless we have to battle someone after this, I don't think we do. I mean, I think Scott is his own ending. Here we go! I almost wonder if we could have done that without chips. I think it would have been really tricky, but I know I think it might have been possible. And that's a lot of experience. That's how you level up your your team right there. And 500 tokens, not bad. Would have preferred a thousand. <laughs> That- oh, it's not? I guess we do have to go against Scott still. Let's see how leveled up my party is now. 29, 32, 24, 20. He was 16 before, I think. 23, 21. 33 plus trap is our strongest right now. But... I, um, I think we're gonna go into this tent and I think Scott's gonna be there. Yeah, yeah, yeah he sure is. Let's do it. No bites involved. That's some real dedication. Great job. Most people are content playing through a game on normal mode, but not you. There's always an overachiever in the bunch. I guess that's you. <laughs> so it's your fault then for my misery. It's never enough for you people. I know. I, I know. Don't you get it? I can't do this anymore. I won't. And yet he does anyway. I love this boss theme. It was fun being the puppet master, but now I grow weary. It is time to put you in your place. Now let me show you how this game ends. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, the game start or the song started over again. All right, we gotta be really, really careful with those gift boxes because I think he's gonna absolutely destroy us. We don't even get to see his health. Oh boy! Oh, he just uh, wipes off all the gift boxes when he does that. Oh my gosh, that's bad. Um... Oh! Okay, we need gift boxes. ASAP. Please. 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 Please! Oh my gosh! I'm actually afraid of leaving this team now. Oh wait, I can't. Can I? Is my other team dead? Uh, yes, they are dead actually. We are stuck on this team. Oh my gosh. Okay guys, we can do this. I believe in us. Come on, Shadow. Shadow Bonnie, you are carrying this team. Everyone else is doing the damage, but you're the one keeping us alive. Oh no, it's over! It's over! Come on! Plush trap! <laughs> I think we need a pizza box user on our other team too. Not pizza box. 
uh, gift box. <laughs> Pizza box. That's a little different. Yeah, okay, our second team needs to have a gift box user. We can't do it without it, I don't think. Let's do this. No! There's no song. There's no theme song. Okay. I guess that's how it is. It's a little less epic this time. Oh well. Wish me luck, I guess. Oh, I lost one of my teams. Crap. That's really bad. Come on, gift boxes. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I don't want to lose this team too, man. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, it's over. Alright, here we go. Attempt number five, no bites. Don't forget your tactics. There is no music. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, don't forget your tactics. Okay, so that's available now, so I can switch sides. Now, if I'm ever in danger, like I am now, I switch back and immediately use gift boxes. Now I have to go around the circle and get back to gift boxes again. Even though I'm in danger right now! <gasps> oh, shoot! Shoot, shoot! We gotta switch, we gotta switch. Oh my gosh, this is bad! Oh my gosh, that's so bad! Holy crap! Okay, we- Oh my gosh. That was terrible. That was legitimately terrible. Oh no! It happened again! gift boxes! <laughs> Alright, attempt number five was my last attempt without bites. We're going all out next time, because I don't know. I don't think I could do it without them. We tried! Come on, Nightmare Bonnie. <laughs> this is it. Now we're just gonna stay on our team number one. For now, um, we're only gonna go back to team number two, obviously if we're dying, and also when our endo army runs out, which it just did, so joy! Let's get around to our gift boxes before we switch. Oh, we need to actually use the gift boxes before we switch. It's too dangerous not to. Can we switch or is it super sketchy? I don't know. It feels pretty sketchy right now. And no army! Okay, okay. Get to the gift boxes. Get to the gift boxes. We're not there yet. Come on, get to the gift boxes. Okay. Maybe we can make one more round? No, I think it's too sketchy without having two gift box users. At least we got the endo army out. That's all that I wanted. When there's an emergency- Oh, that's an emergency! But we got the gift boxes. We're good, we're good. When there's an emergency, um, Funtime Foxy will not be using Cosmic Song, obviously. But when we're safe, decently safe, she will. Which is not right now, we are done. We are not safe right now. <laughs> so full sweep could be super dangerous. And Scott likes to use the full sweep. Now if I could get back to the endo army, that'd be lovely. I just don't know if we can. No. I need to use gift boxes immediately. Oh boy. Oh boy. Gift boxes? Thank you. <laughs> oh my gosh, I need to use gift boxes again! Oh no. Okay, come on, come on. Let's see them, let's see them! Oh, bro! Okay, we're gonna have to use hers again. Holy crap, this is... I don't know if we can even risk going into our second team. Like, it's almost too dangerous to. Maybe we have an opportunity now. We do, we do. We have an opportunity. Hopefully... This ends well. That was not 
what was supposed to happen. Okay, it's good though. It's fine. It's fine. We might still have an opportunity to come back and do it. We'll have to see. Oh my gosh! We actually won! I didn't expect that! Okay, alright, I get it. Was this really the ending you wanted, coming all the way here just to kill me? Was I really the villain in your mind? I mean, sure, this was definitely one way to bring the story to a halt, but surely there was a more satisfying end. I just do what is demanded of me. I fill your insatiable gullets with more and more and more. And now, here you are to show your gratitude. Well, congratulations then. I haven't brought this story to an end. You did. So feel good about yourself for ending the story by killing the storyteller. Ugh, grr, zer, grandma. It doesn't actually say grandma, but you know, Graham. <laughs> I'm sorry. What can I say? I like Five Nights of Freddy. <laughs> the end. Epic music. The end, except. Not the end. There's still more. Um, lots more. <laughs> this game is huge. I know I said I never want to make another game again, but if I were to make a game, if I were to ever make a game again, what I would love to do is make a FNAF world that is pixel art only, includes the entire roster of Five Nights at Freddy's with text, like, um, so you can interact with characters. That would be the coolest thing. It'd be so much fun. I know that there's already some FNAF um, World fan games out there. I'm really not familiar with them, but um, I'm sure there's some great ones out there. But if I were to make a fan game again, it would be that. Because that'd be a dream come true to play. <laughs> All right, let's see our trophy. Scott ending. Oh wait. We got the security trophy too! I didn't even realize that you get a trophy- For some reason, I thought that beating security meant an ending, but it didn't seem like an ending, so... But yeah! We have three trophies now! Um, I really don't know how to get all of them, but I know of at least two more for certain. Two more for certain. And those would be Chipper and the old man consequences. So let's go ahead and let's try and find old man consequences. I all I know is that it's very mazy. But it'll be a nice break from all the battling. And to celebrate our victory, I'm going to put together teams of my favorite characters. Because why not? That sounds like fun. Obviously, Springtrap is still number 1. Wow, I'm so predictable. Number two, though, Withered Freddy! He's so cute! Number three is probably Shadow Bonnie. Love the dude. Number four is probably Endo 2 I love Endo 2 He's so cute. I know Scott seems to think Endo 1 is cuter, but bro, what? No, he's not! Endo 2 looks like a derp! Endo, sorry, Endo 01. Endo 01 is a derp. Endo 02 is adorable. My fifth favorite character is probably Phantom Marionette. I love it. Sixth favorite character is probably Toy Bonnie. Toy Chica would be in the running here if she didn't have her beak on, but because she does. Sorry. Seventh favorite is probably Nightmare Fredbear. And eighth favorite, Shadow Freddy. Alright, my favorite teams are ready to go. Alright, let's battle with our new team, huh? Um, are we gonna be battling Brow Boy? <laughs> yes. <laughs> What's up, Brow Boy? Alright, let's use gift boxes. And okay, so with him, Freddy's gonna be dragging us down a little bit because he's kind of a little bit on the weaker side. But at least he has a debuff, which will be nice, because I'm pretty sure Mike Toss 
44 damage. No. This late in the game, I'm not gonna be using Mike Toss. He's going to be just debuffing, I guess. And obviously, the rest, the other three of these uh, characters on this team are amazing, so there's that. Now let's switch teams. Very interesting look for this team. Um, obviously, Fredbear, freaking strong. He's gonna carry this side of the team. Um, Phantom Marionette's still pretty good. There's no doubt about that. Not bad, I like the attacks. Um, Toy Bonnie is gonna be struggling, and Shadow Freddy might struggle a little bit as well, but Shadow Freddy's mainly just debuffing, so, you know, I think this team, these teams are decently rounded. Decently. Not the best, but they're not bad. Let's see if I remember how to get through here. Pretty sure I remember. Yeah, it's pretty easy. Alright, we gotta defeat Bubba again. Might be a little bit tricky because some of our team is very, very low level. But it should be okay. Actually, there is no point in using escape key against a boss. Okay, so low damage, no. No. They're all pretty bad with Toy Bonnie. We're probably gonna be using munchies, even though that's terrible, I think. What did it do? About 30 per? That's pretty bad. Yeah, Toy Bonnie's just there to look cute. Alright. Um, oh! Actually, Shadow Freddy is completely useless against a boss. So, there's that. I thought he was a debuffer, but no, he's more of a... a murderer. Oh boy, this is actually really sketchy. Can we get a spring locks out, please? Because, uh, we might be doomed otherwise. Come on! Come on! We might make it. No! Wow! Our new team is... Uh, something else! Alright guys, I watched a little video on where the object is that you can go through, and it appears it's this one. Yes! Ugh! Oh, thank goodness. I'm just not good at this. I mean, I tried looking through some of those walls, but I just could not find it. But here we are, going into our fourth layer, which means we're gonna be trapped. So the question is, should we get into the water or should we talk to old man consequences here? I'm sorry to say that you have gone too deep into the code. There is no way to back out. There is no way back out. My name is Old Man Consequences. Come have a seat and let's fish for a while. You have nowhere else to go. The end. <laughs> Obviously I can't um, do anything about this right now. So, uh... And there you have it! The 8-Bit Freddy Trophy! Cool! Or whatever you want to call that. Let's go destroy Chipper! <laughs> now, our current team is gonna struggle really bad against Chipper, so I might go and defeat security just to get that... Oh, are you kidding me? Why would you start me here? I said I needed experience after all. Alright, let's get our other flip side ending, which is pretty simple. We just go back here, and I believe that we glitch into the pond by going back and forth. Is that correct? Yeah, okay, back and forth plus down. Ah! Don't know why we want to drown ourselves, but we did. Never actually gotten this ending by myself before. Is there anything that happens? Well, I can't control Freddy anymore. Is that it? <sighs> I 
I bet the first person that found this ending, or the first few people that found this ending were probably like, Did I just break the game? But no, you broke it in accordance to how it was supposed to be played. So... No. There's nothing. I did it wrong. Oh. That looks like someone holding two children. People used to say all the time that that's an angel, but it looks it looks like someone holding two children to me. But still, I can't- I have a hard time understanding how that's related to this. This is why FNAF is so confusing, man. You see imagery like this that seems like it's really important and you're like, I don't get it. <laughs> Do we get a trophy for that? No! I thought that was a trophy, I really thought it was! I guess it's just a secret ending that's not trophy related. Weird. Wow. Bouncer just, uh disintegrated as soon as he saw us. Alright, onward to Chip Dip. I believe he's somewhere over here. He's to the left. I think I'm in the right mine. I guess we'll find out. No. No, we are not in the right mine. <laughs> there we go. So, I think I wasn't able to go into it last time because I hadn't beaten the game. But now I should be able to? Is it the lamp? No, it's higher than the lamp. Is it that? Oh, it scared me. <laughs> um... I think it's a little bit higher, maybe. Nope, I should be in it. Yeah, Chipper's Revenge! Alright, uh, our team is not the best, but we're still gonna try our best. With this awesome music, man, I love it. Also, does not have a health bar, so that's fun. Oh, we lost our gift boxes. Shoot. That could be really bad. Maybe, maybe we'll be fine. Maybe it'll be okay. Team number two? Come on, we got this. We might have to pull out a better team for this. I'm not sure that you can out-train a team. You can't out-train moves. Like Mangle and Phantom Mangle, they're decent, but they're not good. I've been struggling going against security. This is only the second time I've beat him. And I've tried multiple times. It's just that... Uh, I don't know if you can out-train bad moves. I just don't know if you can do it with this game. It's a shame. I wish this game allowed... Like, as a character levels up to get better moves. Like, that, I feel like that would have been easy to put into the game. That way even characters like these guys can be used later on. 
Because right now, if you try to use them, you're gonna have a hard time. It doesn't matter if they're level 30, level 40, their attacks are still just like a third of some of the attacks of these characters. And it'll forever be like that. <sighs> you know, there's so much I love about FNAF World, but there's so much that I wish that could just be tweaked. All right, we brought back the untouchable team. Let's finish this. Obviously, I still have to be diligent because this is a very serious boss battle. I mean, you use Cosmic Song enough and it should... Oh my gosh, are only our healers alive? Oh my goodness, that was scary. My life flashed before my eyes. But yeah, you use Cosmic Song enough, eventually he's gonna go down. Eventually. And Spring Locks too, that attack is seriously powerful. I've seen it do like 2700 damage before. I couldn't tell you about Cosmic Song, I know it's a lot, but I couldn't tell you exactly how much because I, you know, it adds up. It's not one of those things where it's one big thing, it's, it's multiple. Multiple big hits. Looks like a lot of 150s though, which is pretty insane. If he brings out the wall right now, we'd be in trouble. Glad he didn't. Does he have like 50,000 health? Is that what's going on? <laughs> Maybe. I'm actually super curious. I want to look it up after this. Of course, he's a freaking cheapskate. This isn't fair. It was never fair. It was supposed to be me. It was always supposed to be me. My world was lush and beautiful, full of strange and colorful, colorful creatures, but no, that wasn't enough for you. You wanted to be scared. You wanted to feel dread. And what happened to me? What happened to us? Obscurity. You haven't seen the last of me. Freddy Fazbear isn't the one who will be sharpening his teeth on your bones. It will be me. It will be me. Derp. Yeah, as if you were super scary in FNAF 6, Pizzeria Simulator. You know, when you returned, you were so scary. Total health, 200,000. My guess was 50,000, wasn't it? 200,000! Bruh. Alright guys, what I want to do next is walk back and forth in this area. This area in particular can have a secret mini-boss, kind of like Seagoon that can randomly appear, and his name is Gold Endo. And he, can he pays us a thousand gold when we defeat him. So I figure we might as well hang around and catch him. Earn us some money and see a character before we move along. We're nearing the end of this gameplay, I think. I don't- I think the rest of the trophies aren't nearly as hard to get. Um, nearing the end of the base game I should say, because there's still the update to that we have yet to touch. I'm not touching it today. It's gonna be another day of filming. <laughs> this is a big game. But yeah, I'd like to run into Gold Endo. 
it is a little random f running into him, so it might take a little bit of time. We'll have to see. Yes! Yes! Here he is! Gold Endo! That was like a jump scare of excitement! Woke me up real quick. Alright, we're gonna switch teams and get on gift boxes, because we're not- Well, actually, we don't even need them yet. But we don't really know how strong this guy's gonna be. He's not really harming us yet. So there's that. I mean, he is a little bit, but not really. Cosmic Song! Oh yeah. Alright, so he seems to be about the same strength as Bubba, probably. He looks really cool, though. If only we could have, like, a miniature version of the bosses on our team, that'd be fun. Toy Chica sitting there thinking she's doing something, but she's not really doing much of anything. Alright, let's go back to team one. I don't think uh, gift boxes are particularly necessary right now. You know, doing the little baby bits of damage that these characters do. But Endo Army will be really helpful. Cool. Bash Jam. Oh, okay. Maybe we should go back to get some gift boxes. Birthday! That's not a bad attack at all. I think that's a really good attack. We almost got him down. Mike Toss! 29 damage. Alright. This should pretty much finish him off at this point. It's nice knowing you, Gold Endo. We're ready to spend your body on useless junk. Goodbye! One thousand Faz tokens! Beautiful! No experience, sadly, but it's okay. We weren't looking for experience. We were looking for the monies. And we still need... a thousand... one hundred more to get our last boss drain. And then... and then... we need nine thousand for the last endo upgrade. Yeah. Look at our beautiful screen! We're only missing a few trophies at this point. In fact, we can only get two more trophies without going into update two. One being the Pearl Trophy, and then the other one being the Fred Fredbear Legs Trophy. Which we can't get the Fredbear Legs Trophy because we haven't run into the last three characters for some reason. I've been using the chip Find Characters, but it doesn't seem to matter. But let's go ahead and get the, tr the Pearl Trophy, which is... Um, actually not that difficult to get, weirdly. Look at these three char- I swear, these three characters right here. Those ones you can get normally, I think they're just really rare to find. And I am just struggling to find them. But anyway, we've already got the pearl, like, three times, I think. So I think we only need to get it two more times? I don't know. I feel like I've gotten it a lot. I just kind of stopped playing it because I didn't really realize that there's a trophy until recently. And then I'm like, oh, there's a trophy for it? Alright. <laughs> didn't really know that. So, now we gamble. Earn us some, eh, measly coins? A hundred is not really worth a lot anymore. 
It's a drop in the bucket compared to the numbers that we need. one holy crap I almost didn't get that <laughs> Wow okay now I think we have to battle or something uh, or we might have to leave the map and come back I'm not sure okay we're gonna go make ball boy or brow boy cry for a minute and then we'll be back to play again because I need to earn money anyway Is there a pearl floating in my bites? Is that a pearl? What the heck? Am I going crazy? Was there a pearl floating in my bites just now? Let me get into another battle. There's literally a pearl floating around! I think that means we got it. Does it do something? I think that means we got the trophy. <laughs> I've never seen that before. That's so weird. <laughs> we did get it! Yay! Alright, so we're only missing three. Three trophies. That'd be Chica's Magical Rainbow, which is on update two. Um, the fan trophy which is for getting all the characters. We're still stuck on that. And the Fredbear's Legs, which is, we're still stuck on that. All right, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna run around hoping for the characters all the way up until I get to 5,000 gold. If I get to 5,000 gold and we can buy our last bite and that we still haven't ran into those characters or even if we haven't gotten them, We'll worry about it tomorrow. Well, guys, look at our gold. 4,992. Obviously, I didn't run into a character, so... But we're about to get to our 5,000 gold, and we'll get the rest of our bites. The last of our bites. Um, that's not counting the endoskeleton. But I'm assuming we'll make plenty of tokens in update two to be able to afford the endoskeleton later, so no worries. 69. No character, man. Crazy. It's so hard to run into them. I I forgot how hard it is. It's ridiculous. Is it you? Yes! Austrian X! ka -ching. And would you look at that, the full spread. Beautiful. Now we just need the endoskeleton, but we're getting that tomorrow because I'm exhausted. So yeah, we made an insane amount of progress. We basically beat the game in many ways today. So uh, yeah. You're not gonna have to wait. Let's go to the next day. Hello, beautiful people, welcome back. Uh, it is now my third day of playing this and I've put many hours into it, as you can see. 11 hours. Before we jump into update two, I actually wanted to check that one house that Henry lives in. I can't remember which one it is and I can't remember if we're allowed to go in it yet. But I want to find out, so let's do so. It's one of the houses in Fazbear Hills, that's all I know. I want to say it's to the right, though. I'm pretty sure it's not. It's not these castles. I think it might be this one right here. Will anything happen? Yes! We can go into it! It's a vicious cycle, you know. But then, most things in life are. The pendulum swinging one way, then it swings the other. 
Now we return to darkness. <laughs> Something terrible is coming. Come back later. Maybe I will tell you more. Oh. The awkward silence where he waits for me to leave. <laughs> I love that. This moment was always so exciting. We're like, oh, we're basically like hearing from Scott what the next game is gonna be. You go from happy, which is FNAF World, the pendulum swings back, to darkness, which is obviously a sister location. So excited to play it! And obviously when we play sister location, I'm gonna have to do my hair in pigtails because I dyed my hair red. What choice do I have? <laughs> Ah, oh, so unrelated. I am excited to play that game. But I want to enjoy FNAF World just a little bit longer. There's still more to see. And Fredbear! Hi! In fact, I wonder if this is the entry to update 2. Hello! Welcome back! I hope you're ready for even more adventure! Yay! Look, is it okay if we just cut the crap here? Aw, oh, Fredbear's having a bad day. I mean, what are you even doing here? Having fun? There is nothing new to see here. The game bombed. End of story. I already put in my application at the Fazburger down the street. No! Fredbear! It's a good game! The problem is that now he has gone insane. <laughs> we don't know what he's making, and we can't reach the room where it's being kept. Whatever it is, it has everyone around here on edge. <laughs> you won't be able to reach the room where it's being kept. Any party you would have would get wiped out. The air is toxic, and the Guardian is unbeatable. It's hopeless. I recommend that you exit the game and go find yourself a nice indie horror game. Get some hot chocolate. I don't care. How about coffee? Go ahead. Get lost. Fredbear, what the heck? <laughs> He's making me so sad. I don't want to see him so sad. Fine. Well, look, if you insist on going further, then you need a team stronger than what you have now. You'll need characters that weren't intended you weren't intended to have. I can show you a secret passage that leads to the backstage of the Halloween update. This is where the Halloween characters and others were sent to have their code recycled for spin-off games. <laughs> Put a stop to those games and save those characters. Then find the last area and uncover its dark secrets. Oh, it's so epic. Oh my gosh. I forgot how cool update 2 was. Is. <laughs> Henry. <sighs> the game bombed. I know it did, but... What really matters is what the fans think. I wish Scott knew that. I wish Scott could re be reminded of that, because it's what the fans think that matters. You can have your reasons for not liking FNAF World. That's totally fine. It's not a game for everyone. It's not. It makes me sad that Scott is embarrassed about this game, because honestly, I feel like this game shows a part of him that he was afraid of showing his fans. And when he did show them, it was not entirely accepted. Vulnerability. He was being vulnerable about what he likes to create, what he likes to make, the kind of art that's inside him, and a lot of people said, Get out. But there is a beauty to games like this. There is. I absolutely adore it, and I wish it was expanded upon because it's fantastic. What a blast. Such a cruel world we live in. Alrighty. Shall we? 
We shall. Ooh, spooky season. Oh, I love it. Oh, I love it. It's so dark. Huh. So there's bad guys here, right? I don't remember this very well at all. It's been so long. Ooh, I like the scarecrows. Hello! This is where useless characters are banished and their code recycled to make terrible spin-off games. If you can infiltrate those games and salvage their code, they may join your team. Okay! Thank you! I will do so. Although, I do remember being terrible at these games, so there's that. <laughs> Oh, we gotta get purple guy first! Don't confuse me with the actual purple guy. I'm just a game sprite. Did you know there's a secret path that leads to this graveyard from the very beginning of the game? Um, yeah, I think we used that path, right? I feel like with update 2, Scott was listening to the his fans too. He was like, their fan, the fans are like, Oh, make them talk, please! We want more character interaction! Because we did. We all wanted more character interaction. I love character interaction. Alright, shall we go talk to Scott? Ever since I was defeated as the final boss in FNAF World, I was demoted and sent here. Now my code is being used for some game about a rainbow, but the path to it is hidden. Okay. Hello! Jacko Chica! After the Halloween update, our code was recycled to make other spin-off games. Oh, the indignity. <sighs> yeah, that's pretty embarrassing. It's pretty sad. Whoa! Uh, I was trying to actually... I guess I found a path. What's back here? Oh? Chipper! This whole place is a graveyard of terrible ideas. This portal in particular goes to something unthinkable. A game called Chica's Magic Rainbow. Don't try to salvage my code from it. It's a lost cause. Oh, I'm gonna try! I don't remember if I've ever won, though. <laughs> to be honest with you, that's a freaking hard game. Let's do it. I guess we're going to Chica's Magic Rainbow first, oh boy. Oh boy. Welcome to my happy fun rainbow land. Let's start with something simple. Let's start with something simple. Okay, it's never very simple, but... Whoa! And then we got the sunflowers. Oh my gosh! Simple for most people, I guess. I have faith in you! Oh, oh, I forgot how hard this game is! You can do it! Come on, you can do it! Oh no. This character is so annoying. Ah, don't give up! You'll get it eventually. Is this your first What's the time trick? Game? Excuse me, is this your first time playing a video game? Yes. But really, they don't pay me by the hour, so uh keep up the good work, sport. <laughs> Just oh, it's so cute when kids try to play games. Oh, I hit a checkpoint though. Whoopsie. Wow, what a moron. Oh! Suck. <laughs> oh my gosh, this game is so hard. Like I said, I don't think I've ever beat this game before. <laughs> yeah, I know. Such a lovable character she is. Learn to play. Back to school. Back to school. 
Okay, how did I do it last time? I know I was on the edge here. Maybe I... Her eyes! <laughs> yeah, Chipper was right. I shouldn't have even tried. Why do I care about having him on my team anyway? Get some skills and call me in the morning. Although I don't can you actually have Chipper on your team? Oh. Swearing now. Pathetic. So sad, it's hilarious. Why don't you try, man? I'm losing patience with you. Yeah. What did I do? This is your last chance. I'm gonna kill you! You still suck! Yay, we have to try over. Okay, I'll be right back. Oh, okay, back jump on that one. All right, what's next? Come on, you can do it! Ah, don't give up! Oh, okay, I see. Oh, that's... Gonna be shooting lasers too? Oh! <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely not very good at this one. That was. <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> Why'd I have to turn it off there? <laughs> I'm like, okay, this is where it gets hard. I'm gonna turn off the voices now. Welcome to my happy fun rainbow land. Remember all that soft and fluffy stuff that I said earlier? Yeah, well, I take it back. Welcome to my FNAF world rainbow is amazing land. and I love it. But update two is the worst thing to have happened to it. Update two, man. That's where things ended. That's where things actually got bad. If you want to say FNAF World is bad, then I think you need to look at update two for being the cause. Now, there's things I like about update two, but there is also Chica's magic I have faith in you. Yeah. This game is so stupid. I legitimately hate this game. Because it's so dumb. I'm just wasting my life playing this freaking stupid, stupid game. It's so dumb. This is what happens when you let bitterness control your game creation. Scott, you're upset. You're upset that nobody liked your game. So then you make this pile of garbage that you want us to complete. And we're not even sure why we want to complete it, because it's like, um, Chipper, least important FNAF character, um, don't care? <laughs> don't really care at all? But, you know, completionism brain. And so we try and try to beat this really horrible, stupid game that you made in hopes that we can earn this Stupid character that we're not really interested in. I should have ran. But... Is this the last level? Is it? If it is, then there's some redemption there. But it probably isn't, honestly. It probably isn't.
Alright, what kind of dumb crap is next? This thing again? Oops! <laughs> Symbol for most oh. people, I guess. I have faith in you! You can do it! Come on, you can do oh, it! Oh, the fly, the flower goes off too. Oh, okay. Oh, right there. Okay, come on, come on. That one wasn't nearly as bad as the stupid freaking sh pooping butterflies. If you're suspicious of the way something looks, just jump. Okay, what's next? Are we at the end yet? I get it, I get it. There's probably another one coming, so... Oh my gosh! Jump scare! Oh. Okay, at least there's blood there, so I know. Oh. You still suck. Oh, I have to do the butterflies. Uh. All right, this game requires my hair to be out of my face. It's time to take this seriously. I want to win. I don't know why, but I'm gonna do it. Pepperonis and patience have brought me to this point where I must die in order to find out what even is happening next because I have no idea. Wrecked. Whoa! Scrub. Oh! Fascinating. Shoot. Huh. <laughs> you still suck. Dang it. Okay, that doesn't seem that bad. That's not You're as bad as the stupid freaking butterflies. Let's start with something simple. <laughs> okay, I ate way too many funyuns, but I think I made it to the eye part. I think. Is this the eye part? Yes. Okay. Good. Let's try not to die. Oh, shoot! Right before the flowers. I always think it's the flowers, but it's not. Oh. You really kind of need the first eyes to crash into the ground. Okay. Oh. Okay. Don't be dying so much. You only have so many lives. Oh, come on. I feel like I only just got here, man. I have a newfound hope in this. I watched some people complete it as a speed run, zero deaths. Um, and I feel inspired by people's incredible achievements. My uh, 
My magical rainbow achievements are lackluster currently, but that doesn't mean that they are stuck that way. All right, please, let's get this over with. Let's win. Let's get past this. Let's say goodbye to Chica's magical rainbow and say hello to a bright, shining new future. We can do this. Oh, I didn't jump in time. That is, that is my mistake there. Some part of me was like, you're gonna have to replay the butterflies. You're gonna have to replay the butterflies. <sighs> I could cry. I am a mess. Let me recompose myself and we can move on to brighter pages. <laughs> <laughs> I lost my mind. There you have it. If anybody was wondering how well I handle rage games, there you have it. I don't handle them. <laughs> I would rather break my computer than play them. But we did it, and somehow we have Scott now. <laughs> Anim dude. Neon wall. Uh, that's a. Uh... Okay, yeah, we had that before. Mega virus and the fourth wall, that's a really strong one. I don't know what mega virus is. 2020? <laughs> Sorry. Chipper, you're the you told me that you were the one that was stuck inside that game. This whole place is a graveyard, terrible ideas. This portal in particular called Chica's Magic Rainbow. Don't try to salvage my code from it. It's a lost cause. It wasn't your code that was in there! Don't tell me I have to win twice. Maybe I do, I don't- I don't freaking know. Do you have to like, win without losing? I don't know, but we're not gonna do that right now. We're gonna move on to something funner. Hi! This portal leads to a spin-off called Foxy Fighters. My code was stripped from me and is being used for it. I can't help you without it. Okay, Foxy Fighters it is. I don't remember this one being a rage game, so thank goodness. What's this, a space shooter? Holy crap, is that my voice? Voice acting? No! He's gone too far this time. You need to shut this game down. Yeah, especially with that voice, man. He, it does need to be shut down. Sorry I'm late to the party. Fashionably late, of course. Okay, yeah, so Let's Nightmare Chica is the coolest. High gear. No. Nightmare Chica is obviously the coolest one here. How dare you challenge me? Soul Dozer! I should have known it was you. <laughs> You're not even in the right game! I wasn't fully appreciated in my last outing, but now I'm back to show you my full power. power. Well, we're here to take back what's ours. This will be your last cameo. This game is so, so goofy, so weird. I wonder if I can run out of this power, if I should be using it or not. It's been so long. I really like JJ's design though, with the little, um, with the little scarf. Oh, they, oh, they all have scarves. What am I talking about? I feel like this thing is gonna run out. I would if I could. Hehe. <laughs> Just 
classic video game references is all. Don't know why I'm killing these gear rats, but they're there, so I'm gonna kill them. Sorry. Sorry. I don't know why I'm killing you guys. I don't know why you guys are flying. I don't know what's happening. I'm just shooting because that's what you do when you're flying a helicopter in a video game. <laughs> you guys, Chico's magical rainbow literally broke my brain. Literally broke my brain. I'm thinking I'm flying a helicopter now? These guys make me yawn. I'm really not a huge fan of this kind of gameplay. The most memorable part of the game! Scott is a goofy guy. I think he was losing his mind when he was making update 2. I honestly think that his mind, his brain was leaking a little bit. But it's okay, we forgive him. I don't know if I forgive him for Chica's magical rainbow, but I forgive him for this. Woo! Woo! Watch out for them missiles! Why am I on fire? Oh, that's not me! <laughs> Bye, Nightmare Chica! <laughs> I keep getting hit by those. That's great. Well, are we winning? I don't know, why is this guy partially invisible? Or is it just fog? You haven't seen the last of me. Actually, I think... Great job, guys! Uh, gals! I see the process. Yeah. Let's blow it up and get out of here. <laughs> wow, ranks. Oh, okay. Oh, are we supposed to? Woo! Uh, is it like random what character you get out of each game? Because he just Nightmare Balloon Boy just told me he's part of this, and Chipper told me he was part of the other one. I don't know. I don't know. Let me try and get a rank A really quick, because that was surprisingly a very short game, thankfully. It was a very short game and a um, decently easy game too, which is odd, because the last game we played was not easy. B! I knew it! Not bad! Yes, I know about that. Thank you. Moving on. What's up next? I really like this house, by the way. I think it looks really cool. Oh, I don't know why, but the update too really reminds me of Dreadbear. It's got the whole Halloween vibe. I just love it. It's awesome. Halloween and Five Nights at Freddy's, beautiful together. I love them. Okay. We're gonna have to try and walk through some more walls. We've talked to you already, right? Yes. Okay, we haven't checked out down here. What could be down here? Can we go through that? No. That? No. Fredbear, what's up? Be careful. This is the path to the final area. It's full of toxic air that will drain your life. And the boss is designed to be unbeatable. Only proceed if you're sure you're ready. Yeah, I'm not ready yet. I would like to collect more characters. What's over here? Nightmarian! 
I would help you if I could, but my code is being used for a second-rate horror game. Maybe if you could beat the game and get my code back, that could help. Okay, what is this? Oh, Foxy EXE! Haha! <laughs> okay. Listen to my voice, and you will find the key. Listen to my voice, and you will find the key. So scary. Listen to Ooh, my voice. Oh, I'm getting voice, chills. And you will find the key. Listen to my voice. And you will find the key. This was like the funniest thing to me to my voice, when this first came out. You will find the key. I don't know why, but I just thought it was so Listen funny. To my voice, and you will find the key. Listen to my voice. I think there's like a an key. area where I have to Listen press to up or voice, something. Or maybe I just keep walking, I forget. The key. Listen to my voice. And you will find when you can see how fast can you flee. When you can see how fast can you flee. When you can see huh? how fast can you flee. When you can see how fast can you flee. When you can see how fast can you flee. When you can see, how fast can you flee? I have no words. When you can see, how fast can you flee? When you can see, how fast... Be sure you are step through the heart of madness. Be sure you are step through the heart of madness. Be sure you are step be sure you are step through the heart of madness. Call your big on to us. Oh, I got touched by the cat, so I died. I get it! So I guess I don't have to do anything until I get to the third screen. And then I just can't touch cats. And you will find the key. Listen to my voice. I've been through too much Chica's magical rainbow to find anything funny anymore. Now everything is pain. And you will find the key when you can see how fast can you flee. When you can see how fast can you flee. Freddy, this is embarrassing. When you can see Do you feel embarrassed? Can you flee? You should. When you can see how fast can you flee? When you can see, how fast can you flee? When you can see, how fast can you flee? I'm telling you, Scott lost his when mind when he see, programmed update two. I told, I'm flee? telling you, that's when what happened. See, how fast can you flee? His brain. Melted, and we're all here to witness it. Oh, I get it now. I I need to let the kitties pass behind me. Be sure you are step through the heart of madness. Be sure you are step through the heart of madness. Be sure you are step. Am I well hidden the enough here? Of madness. Woo! Be no. Be sure you are step here. Through the heart of madness. Yes. Be Bye, sure kitty cat. Through the heart of madness. Be sure you are step through the heart of madness. Be sure you are step through the heart of madness. Be sure you are step through the heart of madness. Be sure you are step through the heart of madness. Be sure you are step through the heart of madness. Hey, 
Hey, Nightmarian! Nice to meet you, my friend. We are done with Foxy EXA. Thank goodness. <laughs> now, I feel like there's probably a wall we can walk through here. I feel like I remember one. I might be wrong. Yeah, I guess I'm wrong. Moving on to the coffee pot. Hi, coffee from Desolate Hope. My code is being reused for FNAF 57. I was hoping for a, uh, the Desolate Hope sequel, but I guess this is all I'm good for anymore. FNAF 57, where's that? Can I play? Hi, Jack O'Bonnie. After the Halloween update, there wasn't much use for us anymore. My code was recycled to make some sort of horrendous spin-off sequel. Something about Freddy going to space. <laughs> Freddy in Space FNAF 57. I remember having a lot of fun with this one. It can be a little bit tricky, but this one's actually really fun. Compared to Chica's... We're not talking about that anymore. Press enter. Move, arrow keys. Jump, shoot. Okay. Can I run out of bullets? Nope. I also have to get close to enemies in order to shoot them. What are you doing here? This game isn't finished yet! <laughs> Too bad. Wait a minute, I need to get up there. Oh. Wait, can I die? Can you kill me? Because I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to get up there, and now I can't get up there. Ha! <laughs> I missed it again. Okay, wait. I swear there's something up there! Maybe I'm going- No, there- there's something up there! How do I get back up there? Man! Come on, man! Come on! Fine! Oh! Oops. I already got hit. That's brilliant. I am so good at video games. Get- this game isn't due for release till 2030! Get out! Holding that against you, Scott. We're waiting. It's already 2023. Soon to be 2024. Oh! There's a cat! Why am I surprised by anything? Oh, there's a hidden secret! Ooh! I totally missed the first one. How did you access this game before release? I don't know, you gave it to me, man. Is there one here too? No. Hello, you're interesting. Reused asset of Scott's. It's very, um, very detailed. Cool. Oh, hello. Thank you for that. Okay, we're just gonna run. So you are here to stop me. Yes. Oh, I can't jump that close to his foot. <laughs> Hi, weird alien robot. I like you, you're cool. Ooh, hot! You wanna stop me from doing what? Making crazy spin-offs? Yes, that's my that's what I'm here to do. I don't know why, but I'm here to do it. Um, security, uh, ah, security camera, looks like a security camera, but it's just funny how I'm doing that to it. Oh, I love 
love dropping lasers. It just reminds me of the butterflies. Oh, wait! Ha ha ha, I'll never stop making spin offs. No, I definitely need to go up into there, which means I probably need to run and jump. Which means I, uh, I have to time this really well. Either that or just take damage. Gotta get a bit of a running start here. Are we ready for this? Oh, I definitely... That was amazing. <laughs> that was so good. That was so good. I'm so good. I feel like I could definitely reach that. I love how it, like, glitches, like... <laughs> like, why? Moving on. Oh, which way shall I go? I'm assuming this game is supposed to be... Oh, I think Scott said it's based off of Mega Man. It gives me Metroid vibes. Feels like the classic Metroid. Especially with that tall tunnel thing. This thing right here. FNAF 57, Freddy in space. Freddy was always destined for space. He was. Hello. Pass the lasers. Ooh. Oh, you're actually fine in there. FNAF 58, poop it's in space. Whoa! What's happening? Oh! Okay. FNAF 59, Cupcake Takes Manhattan. Oh, hello, Flan. Well, maybe... Oh, I didn't know that could hit me. Bye! I don't think that I actually have to kill these bad guys. I think it's just up to me, so... If it's easier just to run past him, I'm just running past him. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm killing the tentacles, though. Don't hit me, weird bubble! You're gonna be a little more annoying, aren't you? Cupcake! How many cupcakes are there in total? I don't know. I like the music in this run, though. This one's fun. Oh, am I supposed to go down? I guess so. Oh, I got hit. Thanks for that. That was kind. <laughs> FNAF 60, Breakfast at Chica's. It's a romantic comedy. She's a killer with a heart of gold. <laughs> Such dramatic death. <laughs> down again, but I could have went left. Maybe I should go left before I... Oh, whatever. FNAF 61, Freddy vs. Bonnie. It's the beginning of the Freddy cinematic universe. Ha, huh, okay. I like Freddy vs. Bonnie. But, uh, the FNAF cinematic universe? That's happening this year, actually. Okay, I'm gonna go this way, because we probably missed a cupcake. Why is this music so good? It doesn't even make, it doesn't even make sense why it's so good. Okay, Brain, you're kind of- Ah! Not being kind here. Oh my gosh, ah, just run for it. Screw health, who needs health, right? Me! 
Wait, what? How am I supposed to get up there? How am I supposed to get up there? Is there a run jump type of thing going on here? Is that a thing? No. I bet there's a hole in the wall here somewhere. But if we have to beat this in a completionist way... Balloon Boy's Revenge! He steals everyone's flashlights! What a kidder. If we have to complete this, I'm gonna look up a guide. I'm not gonna check every single wall. Oh! Oh my gosh! Thank you. Making my life a lot easier, isn't it? With your existence. Don't you just love the brains? Reminds me of freaking Jimmy Neutron. I just had a brain blast! Ah! We gotta jump! Does that mean we need to go back? Um, oh my gosh. Bye. Oh, dead end! Busted, you'll never find my hideout. Well, I got high jump now, so... Hmm. Yeah, okay. There's a few different places we can go. But I guess we gotta backtrack. And look for places to jump. Oh my gosh, I'm glad there's no fall damage. <laughs> Look at us, we're just flying through the air. Suspicious. Does anything look suspicious? Okay, we can go back here to get a cupcake. There's too many neutrons! Oh my gosh. I wish he could duck. Oh wait a minute, he can duck? I didn't know this! I wish he can duck and then I immediately duck. Duck is pretty pathetic, though. He's barely ducking. Wee! Look at our jump! Boing, boing, boing. Oh, that was not very nice. Excuse me, I'm just burning everything to the ground. Don't mind me. Oh, excuse me, you don't belong up there. So we can actually go further back before we go this way. Wrong, wrong, go back. I think you missed it back there. You're right, you're right. I probably did miss it back there. I better check. No, I'm pretty sure there's a cupcake this way and I, I really want to get it. So let's do that first. Right at the very beginning. Ooh. Oh, I have 11 health. Oh, I have 6 health. I am asking for death. I can shoot those things? 
Can I shoot this too? No. I didn't know I could shoot the camera things! I hate those! I should have been shooting them a long time ago. Hopefully it's a full he heart. That'd be wonderful. Cause I'm about to die. Yeah. Here we go. What's up here? Cupcake. What the? Okay. So, <sighs> I have six health. I'm about to die any minute. I know some enemies give you health, or hearts. The only thing that I know of that gives you hearts are tentacles, and I think we might have killed all of those. Should we go to the boss with six health? <laughs> I guess. Oh, three! you in there. Oh, thank you for that. I was I didn't even know that was there until you flew into the wall. <laughs> All right, here we go. Going back to the last cupcake cost me a lot of health, which totally sucks, but whatever. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Go back. I think you missed it back there. Ah. Oh. I have a feeling I can go through one of these walls, so I'm going to check them. I feel like there might be another cupcake. Maybe there's more health to be found here. That'd be nice. I very much need health. Heal. Oh, look at that. I like it. I'll take that, thank you. I had a feeling you was hiding something. No, seriously, you missed my hide bow. It was back the other way. Portal? Oh, this is it. I don't get no health. Very well, come to me. I will add your distinctiveness to my own. Distinctiveness. I really like this gun now. It's lovely. What did I just... Uh, whatever. I have no idea what I just killed. But I guess it is smart to just do that. I can get past any laser after Chica's magical rainbow. Oh my gosh! Oh, I lost some health! Oh, uh, thank you. Let me just do that. That way he can't be shooting at me and I can be shooting at him. Because there's probably one. There's probably another one. I like them though, they're cool and intimidating. Sorry, that noise is very annoying. Yeah, see, I, uh, yeah, I'm not playing around here. But he didn't give me a heart. What a rip off. There's another one. Oh, heart! Oh, they're UFOs. Well, I destroyed them before they even appear. That's what I did. Aw, oh, you put one of my hearts in the in the wall. I will grind your code and use it for the game over screen. Oh my gosh, this is it! All right. This doesn't look too bad. Oh. <laughs> that was easy! <laughs> Woo! Jacko Bonnie! Huh! That wasn't so bad at all! <laughs> I mean, obviously, with the good.
All right. I know what I have to do. I have a feeling in order to get the coffee pot, you have to beat that without the upgrades. Isn't that true? Isn't that what it is? I think that's what it is. I really, really, I feel like I remember that. So, here we go. No upgrades, except for the jump. I mean, if I got like a full health boost right now, maybe that'd make a difference. But even that, I don't know, man. Even that, I don't know. Because the amount of damage that this is going to do to one of those chop and rolls, or I guess they're called metal mans, the amount of damage this is going to do to a metal man, nothing. Nothing. It's going to do nothing to him. <laughs> so props to whoever can actually do this, because I don't think I can. I will try though. Shoot my tiny gun! gosh. <laughs> yeah, the first middle man I ran into, it was over. I tried, I tried. That's okay, I don't need to collect all the characters. I know that there's some characters that are basically impossible to get. Um, I probably should have done that with Chica's Magical Rainbow to not lose my sanity, but I did it somehow, so whatever. I don't know how to get Chipper, though. I always thought that you got Chipper through beating Chipper's Revenge. Um, okay. Wait a minute, do I need a grind? I probably have to grind these characters before. Yeah, they're level one. So, let's go try out our new characters then. And try to find our last three. That's probably for the best. We'll do very interesting characters as team one. And team two, we can be like FNAF 4-esque. We still need to earn 9,000 tokens, so that's also a thing. <laughs> uh, let's go to Pinwheel Circus and let's just jump into the Ball Boy boss battle. Or a meringue. Nope, never mind. We didn't even get the chance to check our new characters. They look cool. I've never had Scott before in this game, I will tell you that. Because <laughs> I've never beat that freaking mini game until today. Alright, let's see how they do against Ball Boy. Oh, I meant Brow Boy, but okay, sure. Alright, Scott, fourth wall it is. Oh, that's Nightmarian, actually, who used that. Wow, that was impressive for being level one. Alright, let's use Gift Bot. Oh, I didn't need to do that. Mega virus! Virus drains enemy life. Oh, that's strong! Holy crap, these... These guys have some insane attacks! Huh. Okay. Uh, wow. I'm impressed. Let's check our second team out. Our Jackos! Who is this? Uh, oh, this is Nightmare Fredbear. Jump scared. They look awesome! Any day now. Oh, it's him again. Slasher. One in 10 chance of 99,000 damage? Oh, that's so sick! Haunting. Jackal Bomb, maximum area damage. Oh! These teams are incredible! Wow. Um. Can we just go against security and Scott? Like, would would it be that easy just to do that? Let's, 
Let's look for Gold Endo again. Earn us some money real quick. And alongside that, hopefully run into a character. It didn't take that long to find Gold Endo last time, so... Bubble Breath. Protects you from toxic air? Oh, you have to use- Oh, you need that. Okay, I forgot. That's what Fredbear was talking about. When you're walking through, your life slowly drains very quickly because of the toxic air. Okay, I remember now. It's a good thing we have Nightmare in. But what's Buzzsaw? High damage, all enemies. 3,099? Or 3,995 or something? Cool. Yes! We finally got a new character! And Scott murders him immediately. Finally! Yay! Nightmare! We've been waiting for you a long time, my guy. A long time. Alright, you're gonna have to be a part of the team with Fredbear. You guys will be great together. What kind of attacks? Same? Except you have Rainy Day too. So, not amazing. Not amazing. But that's okay. Let's switch you with Plush Trap. Cool! Some part of me feels like I'm shiny hunting right now. <laughs> just gives me shiny hunting vibes where you're just mindlessly walking back and forth, hoping to run into the rare chance encounter, in which case would be the gold endo and also Fredbear and Spring Bonnie. We have yet to see. And I was actually thinking about it, when we actually get Fredbear, how are we supposed to get the Fredbear trophy? If we can't talk to Fredbear with Fredbear. Like, because we already beat the game, I don't think we can actually have a scene where we talk to Fredbear. We can talk to him in the Halloween thing, but it's different. It's not... It's not the text boxes. With the little characters underneath. It's just text. Surely there's a way. Maybe I shouldn't have opened Halloween and... Edition, or not Halloween. Maybe I shouldn't have opened Update 2 without having gotten him yet beforehand. I didn't think about that. I hope we won't be like locked out of that because that would be really sucky. Not sure how we would fix that. Oh, 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 it finally happened. I wasn't even paying attention. I wasn't even moving actually. Interestingly, this character can come at ya without you even having to move. It's very interesting. <laughs> I was busy, uh, working on something else. <laughs> Gold Endo! Finally! I've been walking around forever. And we are just destroying him because this team is insane. Especially with the fourth walls. Whoa! Suddenly got really loud. And there we go! We get a thousand gold Baz tokens. And we've only ran into one character, sadly. We still need two more. What are the odds on these guys? They're, it's so low. Even with the chip, it's extremely low. Money! Where are we at on our money anyways? 4,500. Okay, so we need to double that in order to get our last endoskeleton. If we had that endoskeleton, it'll help us a lot against the one who cannot be named. As you can see, I've collected way more money than is necessary. <laughs> 9,000! Titanium! Defense plus 100, so now we're probably unbeatable. Hi guys! It is like day four or something of playing FNAF World. It's taken forever to beat this game. <laughs> but as you can see, we've been playing for 15 hours. That's insane. And we're still missing two characters, as you can see. We are still missing two random chance encounter characters. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start off just by grinding 
I'm gonna level these characters up and search for these guys. Um, wish me luck. Yes! Yes! Oh my gosh, it's about time! Yes! Fredbear! We have waited forever to see you, bro! And you die immediately. <laughs> it took one hour and ten minutes to find Fredbear. Uh, wait a second, that's a lie, because I definitely hunted for like three hours the other day. So, four hours! to find Fredbear! Yay, though! I'm so excited that we finally got him! Feels like a dream come true. He's obviously gonna be at the front of our party. All right, uh, Megabyte, Regen Song, and Mimic Ball. I don't want Mimic Ball. I got the chip for that. Regen Song, not bad. Megabyte, uh, it's okay. Yeah, he's not the best, uh, he doesn't have the best attacks, but that's okay. All right, guys, I just can't. I can't do this anymore. I've been basically shiny hunting for these characters for like five hours. We're gonna play this game again on another day because I've been grinding like crazy today. However, I want to actually do something fun today, because all I've been doing is searching for characters. I appreciate that we found Fredbear, but I need to do something fun. Which means we're gonna go and attempt Chica's Magical Rainbow. Also, I think it's pretty mazy in here, but I don't think there's anything to find. Okay, here we go. Neon! Here's my new team. I don't know how it's gonna go, but we'll see. It doesn't look the best because Scott is standing and basically blocking the crying child. Maybe I'll move them around. But we've got our bubble breath, so that's good. Neon, you are a cute enemy. You kind of look like you belong in Space Invaders, though. It's honestly just a Space Invader with legs. <laughs> it's kind of funny. And they know jump jump scare for some weird reason. All right, that takes care of that. I'm gonna edit the first team a little bit, smooth them around a little bit, so maybe they look a little more pleasing to the eye. Pigoon, nice. Oh yeah, the team looks a little bit nicer now. Bubble breath. I kind of lose my mouse in the darkness here. <laughs> this might be actually a little bit harder of a battle. However, we're really overpowered, so I don't imagine it's gonna be dangerous. We don't have any gift boxes though, so there's that. Purple goons, so silly. Yeah, that's pretty easy. A lot of experience. Too bad I don't have the chance of encountering Spring Bonnie here. All right, guys, let's take out our anger on Purple Geist and Chica's magical rainbow because we were unable to find Spring Bonnie, and I am frustrated about that. So we must destroy. Hello, Purple Geist. I need to start being careful because it's about to get real dangerous. What's that? Are you saying something? I can't hear you. Is having babies? She's having babies! The fourth wall was getting rid of them, though! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my- Okay, we really need the fourth walls, don't we? That's cool! The fourth wall attack actually takes those out. That's fascinating. None of the other ones do. 
Oh my gosh. Fascinating. Oh, I forgot that's a thing. That doesn't sound great. Alright, let's get a power song in here. And a fourth wall soon, thank you. Oh, there's literally a timer right now. And we're doing the best damage we can do. I wonder if it's cause for concern or not. Probably. Oh, we lost one of our gift box users. That's not great. Oh my gosh! Oh boy. Wow, that's a close one. We definitely don't want to lose our gift box users. I mean, I know we have one more on the other team, but what's the likelihood? What's the likelihood that we'll actually be able to use it if we switch teams? Low. Did we run out of bu bubble breath? I guess we did. That's probably something I should turn back on. Fast. Oh no! <gasps> oh my gosh! Okay, okay! This- Oh no, it's over, man. It's over. Okay, we really need a fourth wall user. Please! Oh my gosh, it's over. Dang it! <sighs> That's such a shame. I didn't think we were gonna lose on our first try. I thought we were just gonna win. Here we are again. Let's do this. 21 hours. First thing I'm doing today is not going to Chica's Magical Rainbow. I am going to go to Foxy Fighters and all the mini games trying to collect another character because there is more that can be gained here. So like you, Nightmare Balloon Boy, we need ya. So. I'm gonna play Foxy Fighters a few times and try and get A rank. I feel like I've got A rank in the past before, so I don't know why I wouldn't be able to. Okay. Voice acting? No! Oh, this is the best I've ever done! Oh my gosh! Could this be it? Could this be it? The pink lasers, man. If you're struggling with this one, use the pink lasers. It is easily the most damage, and it takes all those are out quickly so you don't have to dodge as many bullets. Please, 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 please. Ah, oh, it was so good. It was so good. Yes! Yes! Yes, yes, yes! We have a new party member! Nightmare Balloon Boy, yes! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited right now! Yes! Yes! Oh, it's so exciting, it's so exciting! Okay, so this is gonna help with Magical Rainbow a lot. What do you have, Nightmare Balloon Boy? Megabyte? Yeah. Bubble Breath? That's good! Balloons, too. Uh, not great. So I'm guessing Megabytes is best attack, and Bubble Breath is useful. It means we could have two Bubble Breath users, which is good. Interesting. Alright guys, let's check out Nightmare Balloon Boy. Oh my gosh. Beautiful. Megabyte, maximum bite damage, or more balloons, more. Whoa! Okay. Maybe more balloons more actually works really well. Megabyte? Okay, yeah. Balloons 2 is easily way better than that. Okay, uh, glad I tested that. Wow. Fascinating. And Slasher, that's what I need to be using against um, Magical Rainbow because if it actually does hit, which, what is the likelihood? It's very low. But if it actually does hit, then we would instantly win, I'm pretty sure.
yeah, Nightmare Balloon Boy just got leveled up to a lot from that battle. <laughs> in fact, that is, is the, that is the first battle he's ever been in. How many levels did he get just from that? 14! <laughs> nice, nice, nice. <gasps> no way! Oh my gosh! What? <laughs> I've only been searching for 10 minutes! I'm so stoked right now. You guys have no idea. I could run a mile with a smile. <laughs> oh my gosh. Spring Locks, Happy Jam 2, Cosmic. Cosmic Song is actually really good. Hmm. I think we need to level her up too. Mind blown right now. Mind blown. Purple guy is unlocked if the player collects all the cupcakes in Freddy in Space. I thought I did collect all of the cupcakes. I guess I should find the locations because he would be a really easy character to get. I mean, I basically collected most of them. I might have been missing one that was hard to find. And if I use a guide, I can easily get him. All right, here we go. Let's go get purple guy. Check it out! My lasers are purple, and I think that means that I have them all. At least I think. So let's go ahead and end this. It should be pretty easy. I'm really low on health, however, this laser is extremely overpowered, so it might not be a problem. We'll have to see. I mean, for the most part, we can just plow through everything, right? I mean, obviously, we can't plow through that. Oh gosh. Did we get him? Did we get purple guy? Was I missing one? I was missing one! Ah! Oh, what? You see that? You see that? There's a cupcake back there! Dang it! <laughs> it's up here? And it sounded like I got it! I did! Okay, okay! Now we just have to beat the boss for real. Come on, purple guy! Come on, purple guy! Yes! Yes! We did it! <laughs> Yay! Ah! Purple guy! 
Finally. We're only missing two characters, one of which is impossible, the other of which is nearly impossible. I'm, I'm gonna try the nearly impossible. But, yeah! Yeah! Purple guy! Speed song? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Not bad. Slasher, which is the best thing about this. Hocus Pocus, though. What the heck is that? Alright, time to do something I'm not exactly looking forward to. I'm gonna attempt to do Chica's Magical Rainbow in less than three minutes, because I believe that is how Chipper is obtained. <gasps> Come on, I'm at 3.30! Come on! <laughs> Come on, I'm so close, man! You suck! Please! Please, please, please! Oh my gosh! Come on! Oh, it's at four minutes! Come on! Please tell me! Come on! Oh, I'm laughing at you with you. Dumbass. 3.30? 3.30? 3.30? Ah! Excuse me, is this your first time? Come in a video on! Game? We're at three minutes! Anger! Oh, 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 yes, yes, oh, I did it, yes, 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 yes. You guys, I have gained a lot of skills when it comes to Chica's Magical Rainbow. I've gained a lot of skills because there was a time when I couldn't beat it at all and I just beat it in two minutes and 30 seconds. Dang! Dang, that's impressive! That's so impressive! My tummy hurts. <laughs> My tummy hurts. I don't know why, but I am going to the overworld because there is no save here. Or not overworld, but you know what I mean. I'm going back to the main game because there is no save here and I don't care if there's an autosave, I need to be able to click a save button in order for me to feel secure. We have all but one character. That's nuts, that's honestly so impressive. I've never, I never thought I would be able to do this. Chipper, what do you got? Mimic Ball, nah. Buzzsaw, good. Hocus Pocus, I really don't know what that is. Hi guys! You've made it really far into a video. Congratulations, you don't give up. Now you may be wondering, oh, her hair is back to normal again. That's weird. She sure did change a lot in this video. Well, that's because I started filming back in November. It is March right now. And when you're seeing this, it's probably gonna be the end of March, maybe even April. Oh my goodness. I've also been working on three other videos. This has kind of been a very side project video, so it's been put aside many, many times. In fact, I kind of forgot this video was in development. So here we are, finishing FNAF World, and reminding myself that I did have a goal of playing all the Five Nights at Freddy's games last year. But hey, we're not giving up. I am not a quitter. Even if it takes me a really long time to play all the FNAF games again, I'm still gonna do it because, in my heart, I want to. So let's get FNAF World over with, huh? There is still some trophies that we need to get, I think. We have to get the Fredbear legs. Uh, I don't even know if it's physically possible. Uh, we also need to beat the rainbow. So the rainbow is kind of like the first thing that we're gonna be doing today. Alright, I'm assuming this team is probably already ready to beat the rainbow. 
which we've tried once or twice. I can't remember how many times we've tried, but we have never gotten anywhere close to succeeding. However, I did talk to Puggos recently, and he is very good at beating this game. He's beat this game many times, and he's told me, which is something I probably should have already known, but hey, he told me that the only way you can beat the magical rainbow is by hitting it with Slasher. Because Slasher is an attack that hits like a train, if it hits. There's like a 1 in 3 chance that it hits. Let's check that again, I don't remember. remember. Oh, I don't think it's gonna tell me here. But, we need to have Slasher on every team. Because that is the thing that we have to use over and over and over. I'll meet you at the rainbow. Prepare your eyes. Uh, seizure warning. Definitely. Oh! Alright, we get a little bit of practice, we get a bit of practice, okay. Uh, I definitely froze, even though this is practice. <laughs> Four neons. Hey, you never know, maybe we'll level up from this, that'd be nice. Yeah, this is just absolutely a mess to look at. There's just numbers and lights and shaking screen and it's just crazy. And it's gonna be worse. You guys did great! Any levels? Yay! Nightmare Balloon Boy leveled up! Okay. I'm down. Now for the real, real, real boss. Purple Geist. Definitely. Okay, let's go! Bubble Breath! <laughs> Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go! Cosmic Song! I'm not listening to anything you're saying. We're just going to beat the crap out of you. Oh, I'm supposed to do Slasher. Where's our Slasher? Slasher! I don't think that hit. I don't think that hit. Um, I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Oh, fourth wall, fourth wall, fourth wall! Ah! Uh, we lost our balloons? Shoot. It didn't hit. Hello? Oh, wait, we don't have a gift boxer. We don't have a gift boxer over here. I forgot. Oh yeah, we're screwed already. Attempt number two. Over again. Attempt number three. You stupid, idiotic moron. I did do a little bit of a team switch up, but it's probably not anything you would notice. I decided to put both my slashers on the first team and my reviver on the second team because she always ends up. They always end up dying, and it's really scary, so. Prefer not to do that. None of the slashers have hit yet. Sometimes the mimic doesn't mimic, which is really, really sucky. Like just now, he did not mimic that fourth wall. Or the slasher! Oh, he did the slasher, okay. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, come on. Oh my god. I think that one might have hit. I don't know if it did. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Give us a fourth wall, thank you. <sighs> okay, we need to switch and try and get gift boxes if we can. There we go. And bubble breath. That is nice. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, we lost our gift boxer! No way! Are you kidding me? That freaking sucks. Okay. Go back to the slashing. Come on! Slash him already! 
I don't think even one of my slashers has hit. I don't think it has, which is really freaking irritating. We still have both of our slashers, which is kind of a miracle. Oh boy, we lost one of our gift boxes for our sl for purple guy. Oh no, purple guy's going down. Oh, oh we barely. Besides, didn't your mommy ever tell you that you can't kill a rainbow? I did it. Next time you see a rainbow in the sky, that is me coming to your house. Yes. Feel free to come to my house. Rainbows aren't dangerous after all. I'm impressed. What are you doing here? Can't you see that I'm busy? I'm sorry. You deactivated my games? Maybe. I did you a favor. <laughs> I didn't know what else to do. I don't want to disappoint people. You should never worry about that. Just do what feels right. But my mind isn't right. I've made something terrible. Her name is Baby. It's too late to deactivate her. I'm sorry. Bro, why? Why you do this? The show will begin momentarily. Everyone, please stay in your seats. No, Henry! Dang, this part's freaking dark. To be continued. In sister location. Yay, I'm so glad we did it. We won the magical rainbow. In case you didn't notice, based off of the fight line video where I talked about the coffee pot being my nemesis. I'm not even gonna try. I, I tried enough. I'm not gonna try anymore. All right, fine. To appease you, I'll try one more time. But that's it. All right, our trophy, is it there? Yay! Our trophy is there. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and try coffee pot, cause why not? Just give it one more solid try and then I will feel completed. Wish me luck! Well guys, I have 16 hearts left. I haven't even made it, so... This is over. This is over. I am really not very good at this game. And I don't know if I have the patience to beat it either. Like, it's just... Ugh. There might be some hearts this direction. Oh yeah, there's at least one. But I don't know if I can even get it without taking damage. Oh, and those guys don't always drop health either. Just only sometimes. Most things don't drop health, but the green seaweed kind of does sometimes. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Please, 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 please. Oh, I got one! That was not worth it, actually. I think I came in this area with 16, and now I have 9. So, kind of a failure there. Oh! And it sucks when you jump into an area and you don't know what kind of enemies are lurking around. Man. I am not good enough at this type of game to get coffee. At least I gave it a try. At least I tried. Sorry, guys. I'm sorry for my inadequacy. All right, let's put Fredbear first. I don't even care who else is on my team. But Fredbear needs to be first, so we're walking around as him. Even though it doesn't matter, I don't think. I don't know how we're gonna get the Fredbear legs. We might have to restart the game. And oh my gosh, that would be a long time just to get that. 
I know that Fredbear is hanging out over here, but I also know that it's not gonna work. Talking to him. Fredbear, look, it's me, Fredbear. He doesn't care. Knock, knock. I forgot that there's a body in there. Bye. Feel better soon. All right, guys, well, Unluckily for me, and unluckily for anybody who runs into this issue, we cannot get the Fredbear legs ending. Because Fredbear is no longer on the overworld in the regular game mode. He's only on update 2. And in update 2, when you talk to characters, it's not the whole little, ah, oh, the two characters are right there and there's a text box and they see each other and stuff. It's more like a just text as you stand on them. Which means Fredbear cannot see Fredbear. Which means I cannot get the legs. Which means I would have to start over, play the 11 plus hours, 15 hours that it would take to find Fredbear, and then talk to him. And I'm not really interested in playing for 15 hours in order to get a trophy. I could cheat, I could, but I don't really see the point of it. It's just a picture of Fredbear legs, I'll show it on screen for ya. Actually, I'll just like, insert it onto my thing, so then it looks like I have it, but I don't. I have all the requirements, I just don't want to put in an extra 15 hours, so that's just how it is. Now, there is one more trophy that I did not get, and that is the fan trophy. And the fan trophy can only be unlocked by having all the characters unlocked, which means coffee, and I already told you guys, I'm done trying to beat coffee. I don't have the patience to try and beat that game over and over and over and over. I'm just not good enough and I don't have the patience, so props to anyone who does have it. And that's that! That completes FNAF World! That is where we're ending it. I hope you guys enjoyed this super long series. Um, as you can see, I put 24 hours into this game, which is a lot of my life. But I don't really regret it because this game is very fun. I kind of wish that I had put more like... 18 hours into it, not specifically 24, because a lot of those hours were just mindless grinding, which really sucked. But yeah, this was a fun game. I really hope that Scott decides to let someone remake this game sometime. Maybe Click Team is working on that right now. I mean, we did get this really cute lol bit. Kind of looks like FNAF World. But yeah, FNAF World. 24 hours of FNAF World. And for you, five, six, six hours of FNAF World? Whatever it is, it's long. So congratulations for making it to the end of the video. You rock and you bless me every single day with the amount of views that you give my channel. So thank you so much for supporting me, my friend. I hope you have the best day and I'll see you next time. Bye.